Okay guys, welcome back to our Let's Play of Deus Ex. Let's go ahead and load a game. Hell's Kitchen, I think that's where we were. Now we had helped out the lady in the alleyway, and then what I was trying to do was trying to find a way to get into that bar. Or this, uh, there's like this underground uh, club over here. Is this it? I think this is it, yeah. And I hadn't figured out a way to do that yet, so. Yes. Open up. We gotta figure out what the password is. What's your business here, Agent? Just going up to my brother's room. Uh, you better hold off. The NSF retreated in there about half an hour ago, and they've taken hostages. We're waiting on a specialist. I'm your specialist. Just tell me where the hostages are being held. No one's standing in your way, but you'll have to go in alone. Our orders are to hold the perimeter. We think the terrorists are on the second floor. Carry on, Corporal. Agent? All right, so let's try and liberate those hostages while we're here. We might get some XP for it, and, you know. This guy's a friendly. Okay. I think we said what? Comma was save? Yeah, so let's get out of my way. <clears throat> and I, I'm not sure if we can actually... Uh, we read this, right? Yeah. Did we read this book? Yeah, it was Indian and Pakistan, nuclear war. Count back from four. Oh, okay. Hold on. Is this the same note? I don't think we read this one. P. Dent and Chameleon. Yeah, we read that one. Okay. P. Dent and Chameleon. We got all the stuff. I would steal that from my office. Were it a bit closer. Six picks. Come on, you didn't. Oh, wait, hold on. There we go. Let's go ahead and save again because we are about to. That should be a straight up headshot. I'm gonna go hide in here. Okay. Oh, let's go up to the roof. Yeah. The roof is where it's at. Remember, guys, I'm trying for a no-kill run. I, I'm not going to guarantee that's what we're going to get, but... No-kill runs are like a box of chocolates. Sometimes it just gets all fucked up and melted. It still feels a bit too dark. Yuck! Yeah, this is a bit dark. Uh, I tried to turn the brightness setting up, guys, but uh, just to no avail. Although, having it dark does kind of help me figure out where uh, the shadows are. Okay. Okay. God, what is with the ladders in uh, these games? You can actually crouch while on the ladder. That's ridiculous. Okay. So, ho uh, presumably one of those guys is... We're going to go ahead and make a hard save here. I know I'm saving all the time, guys, but once again, I'm, I'm just getting used to this game again. I haven't played it that much. Ah! Fuck you. I'm out of here. Don't follow me. I'm just going to let you pass out in there and then... Damn, I need some more ammo for this. So screwed. Well, I'll switch to this for the time being. We'll just go ahead and reload it. That took a long time to reload. Oh, we can, uh, yeah, you can change reload times with the weapon mods. I'm gonna start. Is 
Sorry guys, I'm just taking some notes for my review. And we're also waiting for this guy to, uh... Okay guys, sorry about that. That should have been enough time. Let us make another hard save just in case, I don't know, it freezes everything in there. Which once again, it's Deus Ex, it's War Inspector. It shouldn't freeze everything. Screw you! There we go. Well, if you get close to me, I'm gonna stun the fuck out of you. All right, heat's down. That was annoying. Got some 10 mil ammo. Um, I could heal up. Do I have any? I'm sure I have some foodstuffs. I'll keep the soy for the kids and I'll eat the. What is it? Chocolate Dream. Chocolate Rain. Uh, no, the Soylent Green here. It's people! Uh, let's go ahead and use that. Ooh, in Vino Veritas. Let's go ahead and. Uh, I'll keep it. I bet you there's a wino out there who's gonna be like, give me some wine. And that'll be part of my quest or whatever. Hold on. I wish I could remap this, but I don't think I can. That is so annoying. I had read somewhere that, or heard somewhere, that if you shoot them in the head with the Trank gun... I mean, it's the, it's certainly the fastest way to incapacitate them, but I was under the impression that it totally incapacitated them. Alright, let's go talk to these Thanks. people. Nice. Sixty to catch my breath. Accomplishment bonus. Thanks I do feel accomplished. Those guys. You from the police? You Natco. Yeah? Well, you might be interested. I heard them talking. They said something about it, how they had just put in a generator in a warehouse a few streets south of here. Did you catch the name of the street? No, but they were talking about their security setup. Anything interesting? It sounded like there was underground access. They're using the word righteous as some kind of password. That's very helpful. Thanks. Righteous you password. Saved my life. Underground. Okay. I also like that this is a, a game where you have to take notes. It doesn't just save oh, it to a little a data pad. You actually have to like keep some paper with you, or just have a good memory. Uh, can't get in there. It's locked. Yeah, this is super dark. Data cube. From New York First Federal National Bank to John Palmer. Thanks for clo choosing NYFF. We're excited about your business and trust you've sh and the trust you've shown by placing your valuable assets in our care. NYFF has one of the most secure banking infrastructures in the United States, an impregnable vault that protects you 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. A complete list of your security protocols and procedure is always available at your... Oh, for your perusal at nyff slash nynet.345.23.88 and we welcome any questions or comments you might have. At NYFF, we're not just protecting you for today, but also against tomorrow. You have a new account member is five four your new account number is five four three six five four. Okay. Five four three six five four. Okay. The pin is five five four four. Well sorry John Palmer, but I think I'm gonna take all your money. Uh, for your protection, we recommend that you do not share this information with anyone and wipe this data cube after committing it to memory. And welcome to NYFF. You just about saved my life. I didn't just about save your life. You saved my life. See, she gets it. Bellevue reports increase in admittance. New World Press, New York. Bellevue Hospital has reported a 50% increase in the number of patients admitted over the last three months compared to the same period last year. A disturbing trend, said Dr. James Campbell. A uh, Cabell. Uh, and that's... And one is distre uh, stressing our personnel to the limits. Many of these admitted... Most of those admitted are homeless. That the police 
Sorry guys, I totally lost track of what I was doing. I was trying to think about something else. Uh, our home was that the police can't or won't deal with. Some of them afflicted with the Gray Death. We simply don't have the facilities to deal with those cases, and most of the hospitals refuse to accept them. Many have linked the outbreak of mental illness to recent, a recent, to the recent rise in recreational drug use, in particular the new designer drug Zyme. Speaking on condition of anonymity. Uh, one public official said that Zyme has simply become a threat to the public welfare. There have already been discussions in Washington on a zero tolerance solution. Others have suggested chemical contamination could be the culprit, citing the recent chlorine spill that has rendered the East River almost lifeless. Man, shit is fucked up right now. Okay, well, I'm gonna go ahead and save here. What the hell? I just stepped on a rat. Gonna load. I don't know why he didn't descend the ladder. Once again, I don't know what's going on there. Come on, JC. We can do this. Just gonna go down easy peasy like that. So, bioelectric cell, always good to have one of those. And Omni Tools, I like those as well, so. I do apologize for any of you who may have epilepsy at home. I would skip ahead. This is, uh. It's pretty bad. And I'm not even joking about that. I actually know someone who has, uh, epilepsy. By the way, if any of you tuning in, uh, do have medical conditions, you have unexplained seizures and stuff like that, I'm not actually that big on medical marijuana, um, or recreational use, it's just not my thing, and I know too many people who have, uh, I don't know, they just, they just become kind of lazy, uh, whatever, as a result. Oh, God damn it! Not completely, but I just, you know, I think, like any, you know, drug, Alcohol, whatever, it's very easy to kind of like lose track of yourself when using it. And uh, yeah, so, anyways, but that being said, um, Thanks. this buddy of mine who has this medical condition, um, he used to have seizures like what? Once every two weeks? Once a week? Oh god. Oh god. I hope someone is watching that baby. I was a goner. Oh, there was another way down here. And I didn't even see that when I was in there. Okay, whatever. That thing's on the fritz. I know I heard something. Oh shit. I saw me. Nice. That was a lot of resources to use, though. I could use some more trank darts. I hope there's, like, a black market dealer around here who can sell me some of those. And I didn't know there was anyone on the first level. You all right, Mr. Renton? Fine, I think that's all of them. You got the guys upstairs, right? Yeah. By the way, I saw your daughter down the street. She didn't look so good. Sandra? Was she coming back to the hotel? I took care of a thug who was harassing her, but she's still mixed up in some pretty nasty business. You better talk to her. No. No more talking. If you see her, tell her I don't care what she's been doing. Oh, nice. She can come home. No questions, no speeches. I'll tell her she can trust you. I gotta go find her. I think she's at the bar, but I don't remember. Uh, Gully Foyle, New York. Gabriel Syme, London, England. Paul Denton, New York. Uh, Oberst Enzian. I should probably go find her. Sudwest oh, Africa. Smilia Jasperson, Copenhagen, Denmark and Hippolyta Hall, Los Angeles. Okay, I don't know why he needs to know where everybody's from. I'm just gonna keep healing him forever. Now I'm just curious what my health looks like. 59 out of 100, right? Oh, I'm so screwed. out of water. Damn it. I was so thirsty. Ooh, I got a key ring. Credit shit. 
Okay, Bellevue reports increased to admit 50... Uh, yeah, that we already read that newspaper article. The Man Who Was Thursday by J. Key Chesterson. Chesterton. First of all, what is it really about? What is it you object to? You want to abolish government? To abolish God, said Gregory, opening the eyes of the fanatic. Oh, to abolish God? We do not only want to upset a few despotisms and police regulations. That sort of anarchism does exist, but it is a mere bunch of non branch of nonconformists. We dig deeper and we blow you higher. We wish to deny all those arbitrary distinctions of vice and, vir vice, vice and virtue, vice and virtue, honor and treachery upon which mere rebels base themselves. The silly sentimentalists of the French Revolution talked the rights of man talked of the rights of man. We hate rights as we hate wrongs. We have abolished right and wrong. And right and left, said Syme with a simple e eagerness. I hope you too, you will abolish them too. They are much more troublesome to me. I had a lot of caffeine earlier, guys, so my mind's going a mile a minute. That's why I'm having trouble reading, because my mind's just like, just fill in the blanks, let's go, we have to go! I'm, uh... I'm in my meth head, uh state right now. Totally. Public access. I don't know if we want to do nine hours of reading, but we'll, we'll check it out. So account number was, what was it? 543654. 543654. Five, four. And the pin was 5544. Five, four. Huh? Five four three six five four. Four three six five four. Login access denied. Let's go read that thing again. I think I wrote it down wrong. Trying to catch my breath. You just about saved my life. Ha! Ah. Ha! Ah. Five four three six five four five five four four. Five four three six five four. That's what I wrote. Five four three six five four. Five five four four. All right. Well, we're gonna try it again if that doesn't get us in. But you know what else we're gonna do? I think we got a key now for this. There we go. Let's go ahead and put that away. You know what? We don't know who's in there. It could be more NSF guys. Cigarettes. Ooh, I found cigarettes. I wonder what they do if I smoke them. I know Jensen smokes, like, he doesn't give a sh- Is this guy dead? He OD'd on Zyme. That's depressing. This is a crack den. So again, guys, the parallels to modern society, and I'm just gonna be a little bit of a dick, still. I can't help myself. You know, where we have, uh, like, in, in the in the States right now, we have the, um... We'll read that in a second, guys. Oh, sorry, I didn't read the little thing up there. Door strength. Okay, well, you know what we're going to do? Mm, let's put this... I'm just going to or quick save real quick, just in case this pisses everybody off. Okay, well that didn't really work. I think the strength just determines like how many picks it's gonna take. I only have six picks. I do not want to waste them on this. So let's go ahead and uh, put this back. Trank dart. We'll put that here. Let's see this. Change ammo. Buckshot. What is this? Sabot? We should check that out. If that's not slugs, then 
that might be non-lethal like rubber bullets and we can, might actually hold on to this shotgun um, let's go to our skills 2615 computer trained swimming untrained so we're gonna leave swimming and environmental training alone a demolitions might be nice but we'll check it out weapons low tech uh, I don't know about that one weapons rifle we're already trained on that we don't have enough to upgrade it uh, so computer electronics were trained lock picking we are untrained we need it hmm I don't know if I want to train in lock picking yet I'm gonna I'm gonna hold off okay we're gonna read this Have you been saved? I am he that liveth and was dead, and behold, I am alive forevermore. Amen. Join the net church of God, and know that your immortal soul will truly be saved, backed up on a data cube and stored in our secure, hardened crypt until the day of rapture. Don't trust your soul to other religion that religions that promise similar services based on vague, ambiguous, and unverifiable promises of forgiveness and acceptance, that whoever believeth in him should not perish, but, ha but have your... Oh my god, the way that they... I thought it was two different things, okay. That whoever uh, believeth in him should not perish, but have eternal life. The exact location of our crypt is a closely guarded secret, but rest easy knowing that they're protected by miles of rock somewhere beneath the Appalachian Mountains. Even in the event of a catastrophe, biblical or otherwise, an auxiliary nuclear generator will ensure that your soul's checksum is verified daily for millennia to come, while surface sensors constantly monitor for the last days, when the crypts will be opened up and all souls will be free to ascend to heaven. Why trust your soul to anything else? Oh yeah, the whole idea. I find it existentially terrifying to, like, live in a, a virtual afterlife. You know what I mean? I thought I was a goner. Thanks. I, I just it's it, it's a, a horrifying concept to me, uh, which the game Soma actually sort of explores to some extent. Okay, account number five four three six five four. Let's not mess it up. Five four three six five four. That is correct. Five five four. What the? What if we hack it? Thank you. Come on. Nice. Water advisory. Residents of Manhattan and Brooklyn should be aware that last week's chlorine spill in the Hudson River now appears to have washed ashore and is interfering with the operation of at least one water... We read that. The sub pen. Park closed. Yeah. SF on the second floor. I took care of the situation. What about the hostages? Doing fine. You guys can relax. Guess we didn't need that specialist after all. What did I just tell you earlier? I was the specialist. Maybe not the one they sent, but the one you needed. The one you deserved. That's my best Batman voice. I'm actually not bad at impressions, guy. Just on the spot like this, with no practice, it's they're gonna be terrible. Underworld. So what's her face still here? I gotta find what's her face and tell her that her dad's like, "Yep, yeah, come on home." We didn't go to the free clinic yet. The assault rifle, huh? Well, once again, I don't know if it has uh, less than lethal ammo, so. 
Not gonna be too troubled by picking it up just yet. Commander Freyze, Yunako has regrouped more quickly than expected as we begin a coordinated assault on our position along with local police. They will certainly overrun our defenses eventually, but they must be delayed until the next phase of the missions we are responsible for guarding the tunnels. I think I read this last time. Ooh. It's locked. I kind of want to get in there. I don't want to spend five picks to do it, though. It doesn't have the right code, okay. Shit, let's try breaking in through down here. I hear something that doesn't sound good. It sounds like a bomb or something, so we gotta be careful. Let's go ahead and save. Watch the walls, all of the walls, you never know. Okay, I have an electron. Okay, here's some lasers. No people, though. Well, I can pick that, but I'm gonna. I think, it, yeah. I think I'm gonna break it. Because I can always use the cardboard box. There's another lockpick. Bypass. We have eight tools, so let's go ahead and do it. Nice. Sweet! found this little secret area. I don't think I've ever been here before. When I've played Deus Ex before. Let's go ahead and make a hard save. store that's what we need let's put this away let's go down nope let's go up That's where we have to go. Well, I'm not sure I want to be here yet, so... I didn't finish side questing downtown yet. I saw somebody. Are you gonna knock... Are you gonna pass out? Okay. That took a while. Man, I really need more ammo for my less than lethal stuff. Ultimate Gentleman's Club, Jade Dragon's House of Pain. Alright, so what we're gonna do actually is load an old save. Uh, yeah, let's load the hard save. I don't want to mess with these guys yet. I need to actually stock up on inventory, so... Um, yes, this is the one. Right? Yeah, this is the one. So we can get in there later. We don't need to do this now. I bet you there's some supplies upstairs. A 
I wonder if I can... Oh, you know what? I was, I'm like, oh no, we can't do the thing! Except, I absolutely can. Nice. Oh yeah, Deus Ex. When it's coming together, it's coming together. I mean, you really feel like the the design uh, philosophy, like at every turn. Excuse me. Where you know, like in a proper RPG, your build eventually comes together, and then. Tread on me. There we go. That puzzle was a little more tough than it needed to be, especially for like a special UNATCO secret agent motherfucker like this, but still. Alright, that wasn't a whole lot of gear for however much bullshit we had to go through to get here. The hell is this? A f I don't want a flamethrower. Watch for lambs. I'm picking up sonic transducer activity. I'm sending you a satellite image that should help you plan your approach. Okay. <gasps> Gonna go ahead and quick save again. Case this is not where we want to be. Go quick, gotta get over here quick. There we go. Hmm. I'm not sure this is where I want to be yet. I think this just leads to the same place we were last time, but we'll, we're gonna check it out. New York. In recent weeks, a rash of mutilated corpses, many of them found near docks, subways, or sewers, has gained nothing but indifference from the NYPD. Isolated and unremarkable, in the words of one police spokesperson. But while the police seem content to categorize these horrible crimes as nothing more than simple cases of homicide or suicide among the poor and in indigent, eyewitness accounts tell a different and altogether more frightening story. Some monster knit, says Dickie Cork, a sailor aboard the Matilda Briggs out of Sumatra. Thing looked like a rat, it did. Only it was big, about the size of a lion or something. Numerous other witnesses, all telling remarkably similar accounts of the creature. A rat? Size of a lion? Holy shit. Uh, it was all telling remarkably similar accounts of the creature have come from re in recent weeks, but the police refused to act, calling the descriptions ludicrous without any further investigation. But regardless of the truth, the police choose to sit idly by as the killings continue and poor law-abiding citizens pay the price. Joe Green, senior staff writer. Okay, yep. We're gonna go check. I'm pretty sure this just takes us up to the roof of the building we were already on top of. Once again, I'm trying to do more thad stories in the street. So we'll see how this goes. Yeah, okay, so this takes us here. Yeah, there's the the gentleman's club. All right, we'll take care of this later. Like I said, we need supplies, so let's go ahead and load our save. We don't need to redo that. I'm not gonna worry about that stuff right now. I'm gonna get out of here, go back to the streets, and see if I can pick up some supplies, because we're kind of screwed right now, supply-wise. What the hell is this? Two tools. Let's try it. We loaded, we we'll quick saved, so. Let's go ahead and quick save again. I love that sound effect. Augmentation upgrade. You don't have enough room in here. Oh, well, you. 10 mil ammo. I think they don't want me to go non-lethal. Okay, what can we drop that we don't need? Use? Whoa. Oh, I'm so f***ing high right now. 
Well, since it does just does this, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, drop them. I don't need that. Oh, excuse me. Drop. Drop both. Yeah. I want this. Just give it to me. All right. gonna walk around like a fucking drug addict here trying to get home. No, oh, I'm so fed up right now. No oh my god. Is this ever gonna wear off? I think I'm just permanently like this. Well, guys, we're gonna be playing the rest of the game like this. Get used to it. All clear. So we got the free clinic. We still haven't explored. They got this data cube here. John Palmer, we regret the branch of breach of security in your New York first federal account. Here at NYFF, obviously, take such matters. Uh, we here at NYFF obviously take such matters seriously and will hold you in no way responsible for the damages incurred. All of your assets prior to the unauthorized transactions have been transferred to your account number 947761. This is why it didn't work. This is the same guy, John Palmer, by the way, guys. 947761, the pin number 2867. We suggest you change this PIN number as soon as you have a chance to verify your new account. Again, our sincere apologies. Rest assured, NYFF will ensure that such intrusions do not happen again. Sincerely, Bob Latham, Vice President, Computer Security, uh, New York First Federal National Bank. Okay, so let's go ahead and we're going to save again. Because we picked up a canister, an AUG canister. We can't use it yet, but once we get back to UNATCO headquarters, we'll find a bot who will help us. What does this say? Oh, okay, Chinese lunar mine operational, APR Beijing, China. Chinese authorities today announced their, that their state-of-the-art Zhu Enlai lunar mining complex is operational and functioning at 100% capacity. We are pleased to be making significant progress, not just in pushing back the boundaries of exploration for all humanity, but in developing the lunar territories in a way that benefits the Chinese people and their global market, said Nagia Lam, Chinese premier. Excuse me. While the United States and Nigeria still dispute China's claims to the lucrative uh, Palace Somani and Mary, Marie Chrysium regions, uh, Chinese construction has proceeded uh, apace while diplomatic negotiations continue. We feel we have some valid claim to those territories, certainly, said Robert Holden, Secretary of the Interior for the U.S., but we would prefer to find an equitable arrangement that will allow our countries to work together in developing man's first real home outside of our own planet. The first ore delivery from the factory will be launched by mass driver tomorrow and should arrive in Earth orbit by next week. There's a mining colony on the moon. And New York looks like this. Yeesh. How's that one world government working out for you guys? No weapons allowed. Well, sorry. Cigarette machine. I wonder if they have an ATM in here. I think your friend is going to be all right. What about Johnny? He's on his back in the alley. Serves him right. About time. What can you tell me about his boss, Jojo? Oh, Jojo, he's nothing, man. We used to go out. His body mods? Cosmetic. Scars? I saw him cut his face one time just so he'd look mean. Maybe I'll cap his ass, too. <laughs> well, if you ever want to get into the warehouse where he hides out, I know the code. It's 3316. Thanks. You've been very helpful. Ah, 3316. Very nice. How about I ask you a few questions? Splendid. I certainly would like to know what an international anti-terrorist organization expects to find in a dive like this. Hold on. Sorry guys, just topping off my beverage here. 
Okay, heard anything about secret NSF power? See, heard anything about a secret NSF power generator? Uh huh. Playing the detective, are we? I take it you've been assigned to eliminate certain weapons systems. Defenses, maybe? Am I getting warm? Just answer the question. Let me be more pointed. How does it feel to be ordered to murder civilians just because they support the fastest growing political movement in this nation's history? In a democracy, armed rebellion is criminal, not political. Rebellion, as the Declaration of Independence tells us, is not only our right, but our duty when we have suffered a long train of abuses and usurpations. <clears throat> this is gonna make a great story. Okay. Jojo shouldn't stick us with guys like Johnny. That ain't cool. Was that the girl I, I see? Oh, here we go. He asked me to invite you back home. No strings attached. How sweet. You could at least let your father know you're alright. He knows where I am. You mad at him or something? No, but I don't want him running my life like he runs that cheap hotel. He doesn't do such a bad job. He never got nowhere because he never took chances. That ain't me. I'm gonna do things my way. I think you should be more grateful for what he's done. Let's leave it at that. Yeah, let's leave it at that. Earlier you said something about the smuggler. <laughs> Tough guy like you? Figured you'd be a big customer. He's got a basement place over near the subway entrance. You have to give him the password, Bloodshot, or he won't let you in. Nice, okay. So we got that. Uh, I guess we don't need the cigarettes, but we'll take as much soy food as we can carry for the time being. Alright, let's see. Still going on, isn't it? Lady in He's sweater. Shooting people right outside the bar. Know anything that's worth the price of a beer? Ah, this old bird's had enough. Hell, I'm about to go on duty. What kind of chopper pilot starts work at midnight? You're with your Natco, right? Why do you ask? I'm the one that flies your brother Paul to Hong Kong. He told me to watch out for you. I didn't know you Natco hired pilots. The black choppers are run by the NSA to support various classified operations. Pentagon uses there we go, people. Black system. helicopters. They hired me because I don't ask any questions. What was Paul's assignment in Hong Kong? Like I said, I know how to keep a secret. Even between brothers. So he's holding something back. The reason Unaco transferred him back to the States. Listen to your brother, JC. Respect his experience. Let's leave it at that. Your brother's one of the bravest men I know. What'll it be? Never mind. I guess she doesn't care that I'm stealing all her shit, but that's fine. I definitely need her more than she yes. does. Just curious. I thought I heard you say Ambrosia. My wife has the plague. He already lost his daughter. Sorry to hear that. So do I trust some street punk called Jojo to get me pharmaceuticals? Trust him with my wife's life? I thought Ambrosia was an urban legend. Jojo probably just wants to sound like a player. I shouldn't give my hopes up. I don't know what to say. You just have to do what you think is right. <sighs> All right. Can I ask a question? Go right ahead. I'm looking around for a power generator, possibly hidden, large enough to power a building. You in real estate? I just need to find it. Oh, 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 of course. You know, I tied in power at a place a few blocks south. A warehouse. Strangest thing. They wanted to conceal these gas-driven generators on the second floor. Didn't give a hoot if their own people got asphyxiated. How do I get over there? No way through the blockades now. We went over some rooftops to get there. There was a lift. The code was 3316. Ah, I didn't need to use that. Thanks for the tip. Well, maybe I didn't use the Omni tool yet. I think you should do it. Should have talked to more people at the bar. I think I was super tired last night when I did this. All right, here we go. Let's try this. Nine four seven seven six one nine four seven seven six one with a pin of two eight six seven two eight six seven. Thirty six bucks. Oh, I'm still taking it all. Sorry, Paul. Or I forget if that's his name or not. But whatever. Here we go. Let's 
go ahead and make a hard save because we got digging the soundtrack. I mean, I know that's not <clears throat> a controversial opinion. <laughs> Most people like the soundtrack to Deus Ex. Blockades. Okay, so the roof. Yeah, that's the mission. That's the rooftop we gotta go to. Although I could have sworn there's another uh, building that could be part of this mission or another mission later. I don't remember. Alright, so he's got a shop, and we need to stock up on Trank Darts and Stun Baton Rounds, because I was about to say we may have to go lethal if this kind of shit continues. Yes. Password? Bloodshot. Nice. I'm about to be eaten and murdered. Take a Foudy and the Prod Charger. Nice. Okay, so... So far, so good. What a nice little gift for first-time customers. Our files show that the smuggler is whacked out paranoid. Watch for booby traps. Yeah. The latest news, your brother's team hit some resistance. So they're going to be delayed while we bring in chopper support. Electronic control panel for bypass. Here's an omni tool. Anyways, multi-tool, I mean. Cigarettes. And we got some beer, which I believe restores health. Here's some lasers here. No lockpick. Okay, so let's go ahead and quick save, and we're gonna start exploring where the hell this place goes. So let's go ahead and pick this. Ah! I gotta say, the default controls are garbage, but the the different, the level of control that they give you in the game is pretty nice. Four picks. I don't think I'm gonna do that. No, thank you. Okay, so let's go ahead and turn this off. I'm wasting like bioelectric energy, which is pretty cool. I actually work uh, my research is in fuel cells, and I remember uh, one of the projects that my uh, PI was involved with before uh, project I was put on was actually using blood. So they, they developed a fuel cell that actually uh, worked off of blood glucose. So, so you could power the fuel cell with glucose. And what they were trying to do was create um, sort of like Deus Ex style prosthetics that would use your own glucose level to power uh, like prosthetic hands and arms and stuff like that. He said the power, uh, the energy that they could get out of them wasn't really significant enough, but I thought it was cool as hell that you would feed your own blood into part of the uh... um... part of the prosthetic and that would power a fuel cell to uh... to power obviously the rest of the device the prosthetic device which is super cool ooh ballistic armor uh... what can i drop? What can I drop? What can I drop? Can drop these. Wait, hold on. I already have ballistic armor. Well, I'm gonna drop these two. Grab another one. Okay, I got two ballistic armor now. Nice. Let's go ahead and save again. We got a bunch of good loot. Don't want to be too threatening when we get to him. Kill this rat. It's like rats are like the cockroaches in uh, Half Life. What do you want? Why the booby traps? Afraid of something? Just precautions. Against what? Government's been having some kind of crackdown all year. People I know, they've been disappearing. <clears throat> Is that so? Think it's a big joke? Lift up a grate in the street. They got my friend, Boy Chick, in a secret lab next to the sewers. A lab? In the sewers? Maybe he was taken hostage by the NSF. These guys are pros. Definitely government funded. Interesting. Maybe I'll take a look. But I think you should have a little more regard for the United States government. 
If you're serious about going down there and finding Ford, I'll give you a deal on some hardware. Also, you'll need this. It's the key that can open the sewer manholes. Tell me about the hardware. I have a scope that will fit most handguns and rifles for 2,200 credits, a bioelectric cell for 800, and some light amplification goggles for 3,500. That's it? How about you give me the bioelectric cell for 750? Deal. That seems like a waste. I thought I was gonna be able to buy trank darts and stuff from this guy. Ugh, this sucks. Uh, just taking some notes, guys. Well, I'm gonna rob him blind then. You don't have enough room in your inventory for the candy bar, that's fine. Man, what a waste. I thought I was really going to be able to like pick up some, some more ammo and stuff. I do need just a store. That's what I need. I don't need any more of this. Like, oh, I'll send you, I'll sell you this thing that you find lit throughout the streets for like a million credits. What the hell is this? Bypass. Two keys. Probably something behind this mirror. Lockpick. I don't know that we really need flares, so I could probably get rid of those. I do like lamps, though. Those are fun. Get up there. Alright, let's go ahead and save in case he gets pissed off. That we're like breaking his shit. Well, at least I'm loading up on prod chargers. I don't need any 7.62 ammo. Hold on. I'd just like to point out too, like this level of like, hey, you can use the chair and then climb up the chair and then climb up the boxes and pick it up and move things around the environment. This was pretty novel for games back in the day and it, you know, it's something that has disappeared from games. Now I know I can't actually climb the chair. I think the hitbox for it is actually rectangular, that's why, but uh, still, would have been cool if I could. And I think there's crates downstairs anyways I can use to try and climb up if I want to. Book. Uh, the Modern Terrorist Handbook, Section 7C, Computer Virus Cultivation. One tool or weapon, not to be neglected, in the arsenal of modern terrorists is the use of computer viruses to cause disruption to major city services and infrastructure or other targets of opportunity. Current heuristical viral stalkers are... I don't know if the misspellings are on purpose or not. Oh yeah, that's that's the error. I think they just didn't edit that correctly. Are ineffective against modern polymorphic hothouse engines available from any sites on the on the internet. Uh, can be easily be linked to IP tunnelers for a cheap, ineffective, or a cheap, effective denial of service attack. Or with some programming skills and icebreakers, a, mo a mutagenic crash and grab bird can be grown uh, for the trativial of specie info from the unfortunate victims. The following pages will discuss some of the more typical viruses such as the Bandersnatch, V128, Ulysses Dilemma, and 109. Okay, there's a lot of techno jargon that I'm not super familiar with. Basic firearm safety rules. Never point a firearm at anyone or anything you do not intend to shoot. That's a very good one. Before handling a firearm, understand its operation. That is also another very good one. Three, always keep your have your firearm pointed in a safe direction. Also a very good one. Four, keep your firearm unloaded when not in use. Eh, depends what your uses for it and applications are. Uh, five, treat every firearm as if it were loaded. Absolutely, even if you are 1,000% sure that a firearm is not loaded, you are supposed to treat it as if, it's, as if it's loaded. Never, ever, 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 ever treat a firearm like it's not loaded. For any reason. Uh, never pass your firearm to another person until the cylinder or action is open and you visually check that it is unloaded. This is also true. 7. Place your finger inside the trigger guard only when you are ready to fire. Also very true. This is great. Thank you, Deus Ex. That was a great PSA right there. And those are all true. I'm not even being facetious. That's absolute great firearm safety uh, rules right there. The Reluctant Dictators by Travis Crockett, Introduction. Organized at the end of the American Revolution on May 13, 1783 by General George Washington, the Order of the Cincinnati... The Order of the Cincinnati was ostensibly formed as a fraternity to recognize the accomplishments of those officers who had served with distinguishment during the Revolution. However, the true purpose of the Order was this cultivation of military force ready, willing, and able to accomplish a coup d'etat if the fledgling American democracy began to stumble. Skeptical at the viability of the untried democratic system, Washington took counsel in the story of the Roman generals. 
Cincinnatus. Ah, oh, now the order of the Cincinnati makes sense. Uh, I thought they were naming after the city, which they sort of were, because I'm sure Cincinnati was probably named after this. Uh, Cincinnatus, who was called from retirement to serve as dictator for 16 days in the defense of Rome, after which he returned home to his farm. In the wake of the revolution, the United States was vulnerable to any number of outside forces, and Washington felt that a strong central authority had to be present that could assume control of the government if necessary, and temporarily suspend the Constitution if required. Washington resigned as president after only two terms in office, but remained president of the Order of the Cincinnati till his death. The order still e exists to this day, a shadow organization of wealthy and powerful of the wealthy and powerful that has been linked to any number of other organizations ranging from the Illuminati to the Trilateral Commission. Huh, I am learning all sorts of interesting conspiracy theories. Now, I have to look into that Order of the Cincinnati. That's fascinating. What's also fascinating is that if you actually look at American history, uh, yes, George Washington only served two terms, and he did not want to be president. Um, he argued against the two-party system, and they offered him a kingship of the U.S. as well, and he uh, declined it. So I think that's a little unfair to say that he was he was probably skeptical of democracy, but I think generally for it. Um based on his actions in life. But I that that would be interesting if that were true, that he he kept this sort of secret organization, well, not secret, but this organization around to step in um, and take total authority of America, if need be. Thermoptic, thermoptic camo, that could be useful. Um, what else can we throw out? Let's go ahead and use this. Healed two points. Let's get drunk. Uh, okay, now I'm wasted. At least we can use this. Uh, come on, there we go. So, this can be applied to these. If I do have to go non-lethal, I would like to remain stealthy, so I'm going to go ahead and upgrade this one. Stealth pistol. Move this here, and then I'm going to grab the thermoptic camo. And then I'm just, I'm a little sleepy. And I'm just going to, I just, I just need to rest my eyes. That's, actually, I need a trip to the... I'm gonna call an Uber. I need tacos or Jack in the Box or something. Or Jack in the Box tacos, even better. I might try and hack this guy's fucking thing. Okay, it's getting a little better. Um, let's go ahead and make a hard save here. We did use two Omni tools, but whatever. Username, uh, let's go ahead and hack it. Oh shit, okay. Uh, current user hidden. Uh, we'll try and figure that I may have to look up how hacking works like for computers and stuff I'm pretty sure when that timer runs out I get caught um, or it just kicks me out so we got to find a way to sort of get the, the passwords and stuff it's cool that like flies show up uh, when you kill something that's pretty cool so let's go ahead and save again. We're gonna see if we've gotten, if the key that we got also works up here to open this up. Damn it. Okay, so we're gonna go back down and now we can go into the sewers. Now, I need to check my goals. Alright, goals and notes. Secondary goals. Rescue smuggler's friend Ford Schick from a secret laboratory in the sewers. The sewers are accessed by the grates in the street. Uh, locate the stolen barrel of Ambrosia in Castle Clinton. Oh, wasn't Castle Clinton the free clinic? Oh, no, I know where Castle Clinton is. We'll go back. 
Yeah, we're gonna go back. Okay, sorry guys, we are gonna be doing some backtracking here, but hopefully we will come upon some interesting stuff. You know, I'm gonna go find all of the sewer grates and open them up while we're while we're at it. Yeah, I don't think we do that mission yet, but I am gonna grab this ammo. I'm also glad that ammo. I mean, just because the inventory is fairly small, it does not take up more inventory space. Now, I don't know if you can expand your inventory. That's the thing. Let's see. Yeah, I don't think you can. I think it's just that for the whole game. So you got to keep that in mind. And I might get rid of the crowbar if I have the combat knight, because this is uh, f two spots, and this is fucking one. You know, although I could freak people out if I just start, like, waving around a fucking razor-sharp hunting knife wherever I go, but I don't know. We'll see. All clear. I don't want to tell you your business, guys, but I can tell you from my experience, this is this is kind of the way to play Deus Ex. Explore everything, have a good time, make decisions on your own, um, tailor it to your playstyle. That's the way you do, do it. Don't think that it wants you to do a specific anything. You can't make those assumptions about Deus Ex. Um, the only thing I would say is that I don't think you can, but I could be wrong, play it like a straight-up shooter, but who knows? Maybe if you invest all of your points at the beginning in the rifle to where you're, like, a well-trained or master at the onset, then you can play it more like a shooter if you want to. And you get ballistic armor and stuff, so yeah, maybe that's maybe that's possible. Uh, if I get the thing of Ambrosia, I think I'm going to give it to the guy in the bar. Took him out. But So we're going to go back to Clinton Castle, Castle Clinton, whatever it is. Now we do have guns in case we, but I'm gonna try and kill as few people as possible in this run. There are definitely some people I remember from my first playthrough where I'm like, you know, I wouldn't mind shooting you in the face. Or with a, uh, Gep gun. But there's some other people that maybe not. Now I think I did take everyone out at the last place, but just in case I didn't, let's go ahead and... I'll be okay, thanks. I'm not going anywhere until the shooting stops. Okay, well the shooting just stopped, so... Why don't you go... Can I bypass this fucking thing? I think it's rigged to blow all this TNT if, uh... Yeah, pretty sure of that. Oh, yeah, that's why I don't have any Trank darts. I took out all of these guys. Uh, non-lethally. Where's the damn... Alright, let me put on my light, just in case I can't see where it is. And that kid told me something about an ATM or a soda machine down here, right? Said something to that effect. I'll be okay, thanks. He said they do something behind the soda... Maybe the soda machine's up there? I don't know. But he could have been talking about Castle Clinton. Alright, let's go check this out. Oh, it's all part of the same, yeah. Yeah. It's just which way do you want to ingress into the room. Okay. I think we just go to the end there and then we're out. Yeah. That's just one way in, another way in. Okay. Oh, there's a ladder. But we didn't go this way, I don't think. This is another way in. Check this way. I don't think we came this way last time. It is a little horse shit that this takes so much uh, bioelectric energy, just a stupid flashlight, but whatever. We'll try this other one over here. I don't think I went through that one. This 
one? Or wait, was it? No, it was this one, right? Can't remember now. Yeah, it was this one. be a way to shut off the the thing nope okay so this is just so you can get a bird's eye view of what's going on plan your plan your attack I'm pretty sure so we're gonna go back up this way but we're gonna go look for that soda machine so we can disable those lasers because I don't I want to be able to just get in and out of the subway I don't want to have to do this every single time or I'll lose my... F I'll go out of my tiny mind. Excuse me? What in the hell? Come on, man. Come on, dude. What the fucking... Get up there. Oh my god, are you serious? Okay. Try and get up a different way. This is just ridiculous. If I can't get out of here because that thing's broken. Oh, here we go. What the hell? Here's Battery Park. Alright, so we're gonna go over here. No soda machine. For reals. Come on. Move it. Grab another one of these. I said something about a soda machine, but that, like I said, I think that's Castle Quentin that we're gonna have to check out. Nobody has any trank darts? Of course, you all are content to just shoot each other all day. What's that? Oh, it's a knocked over lamppost. Alright, let's go check out Castle Quentin. Oh, shit. I'm gonna go ahead and make a hard save here. There we go. I don't want any more 10 mil ammo. Okay, those two are good guys. Well. <laughs> Uh, as we've discovered, that's very relative and subjective, so uh, let's not call them good guys. Tis of the sweet land of liberty of the I thought I already went inside Castle Quentin, that's why I didn't think we'd have any resistance, but we'll see. We've got your back, Agent. I have located the barrel of Ambrosia myself. You did? Well, okay. I guess I still have to get it, though. Don't let me get in your way, officer. That's a friendly dude. Once again, I like that it's canon, how, like, why the reticle shows up, and why it turns green on certain people. That's actually one of the augments we have. Also, this uh, identification system, identifying crates and boxes and things like that. That's, that's one of our augments. It's not just like, whatever. 
I wonder if this is... Let's go ahead and put it on and see. It's too heavy to lift. Alright, so we can't pick up anything that heavy yet. Go ahead and save again. Ammo one. Let's just reload it. So we don't get caught with our pants down. Yep, some so there's a broken soda machine out here, and the kids sent something about a soda machine in there, so I'm guessing we should investigate that. There's a kid. He scared the shit out of me, by the way. Right there. I was like, oh my god. Hmm. It's secure. What does the kid say? A lot of logs. Uh, conversations. Anna Navar, bum, older sick man. Dan, jock. Former hostage, smuggler, woman. Why don't we talk to the kid again? Thanks, mister. Billy. Billy, come back here. Stop closing doors on me, Billy. I have to talk to you. Billy? Alright, well, okay. Let's... Okay. Should be something in here with Billy, right? Pimp. I don't think that's Billy. Bum, damn, but, but, but. We talked to him, I swear to Christ. Thanks, mister. Come on. I know he gave us the, the code. going to starve to death. The terrorists didn't even care. They thought I was lying. Hmm. Alright, well let's check out their conversations. I'm, I swear someone told us. Uh, Anna Navar, former hostage, smuggler, smuggler's lair, Anna Navar. Josh. 9183. Thanks, mister. Oh, Josh was a different kid, I think, maybe. Hmm. Just let me in here. I have ten picks. I could pick that. It's only three digits. Uh, and one, eight, three. Nope. Well, shit. I thought I knew it. All right, we're gonna save, and then we're gonna just. Two tools, though. Oh, one tool. Hope we can find some more Omni tools somewhere, though. I could have just pressed two. Quite sure. goes back and forth. Let's make another uh, hard save. Nope, that's not where I want to be. 
wonder how many there are of them down here. Does he see me? Yeah, he sees me. Oh, damn it. Well, come on. Damn it. Okay, so we're gonna go. Oh, we wanted to load the... Let's go ahead and quick save. Screw it. I think I can take this guy. I'm just gonna reload real quick. I don't know where he is though. We'll find him. We'll find him. Oh, this is the sewers. Oh, okay. Sorry if it's a bit dark, guys. I'm trying to remain undetected here. I need to disable all those security cameras. Maybe if I can get the guy from the vent here. Really? It lit up red. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and uh, load. Yeah, I guess we'll just load this one. Multi-tool, ammo. Now we, okay, so this is getting pretty hairy. Oh shit, there's another security camera. Hold on, I'm gonna try something. First of all, I have no use for a super loud gun. So I'm gonna put that in there. Um, okay, hefty baton typically used by riot police and national security forces to discourage civilian resistance. Weapons low tech, base damage seven, uh, let's compare that to the charger prod base damage 15. I can't tell if this is non-lethal Hmm Incapacitate taken under two seconds anti-gun. Oh, okay Uh Keep away from children under the age of... Okay, so... What the hell uses the pepper? Flare dart, dart rounds. Darts loaded. I guess that kills people. So I don't want that, necessarily. Uh, 10 mil ammo. Buckshot. Nope. Charger pride. Nope. What the hell uses the pepper spray? Oh, pepper cartridge, there we go. All right, I'm gonna put this, um, here, I don't need flares. And I'm gonna put the pepper cartridge here. Wait, hold on. Did I just drop stuff? Hold on. No, I don't think it dropped anything. Okay. Okay, so under two seconds, you say, huh? And I have a hundred uh, rounds for this. Okay. Hmm. Oh yeah, I was gonna try something. Hold on. Oh, god damn it! Okay, guys, uh, we're gonna load. What the f Okay, we're gonna load that quick save. Jesus. Alright, where- where was I? Guess I already did this. Found a multi-tool, okay. 
Wait, hold on. No, I didn't do anything yet. Okay. So this has to go in here. Um, this needs to go right here. And... Yeah, okay, I didn't, I didn't, okay. This was before we changed out our ammo. So we're gonna change here, here, here. I'm gonna go right here real quick. And we're gonna save once again. Sorry, I had the thing in my inventory, but my finger accidentally slipped on the mouse wheel. And then uh, I switched to a new weapon and he was already hurting me. And I was like, oh, I can't. It says incapa- I guess that's incapacitate. That was a, a waste right there. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. Uh, load the quick save. We're gonna try that again. It sucks that I can't pick up a body unless I've looted the corpse already. That's kind of horseshit. Oh shit! Fuck you. This pig. Oh god, it's got him. He's a cop. Oh, I'm so screwed. Okay, I'm starting to rethink this non-lethal thing. But that was a, that was a fair strategy. How much ammo did that use up? Okay, 25 ammo to incapacitate one dude. Okay. Let's go ahead and make a hard save and see where we're going. Let's save again. Let's see what's up here. I wish the gas grenades caused them to pass out. I don't know why they don't. Like, they made it really hard to ink up, like to go non-lethal in this game. I mean, this is what we were going to try. The other... I need to know if I can take these fucking things out. Ooh. Come on. Dude, what's going on? Just lean. Are you telling me the cameras are indestructible? Well, good to know. No idea where I'm going. This feels like the wrong direction. If there's anything down there worth checking out. Ooh, look at that. Oh, the soda. God damn it. Didn't have to waste that uh, Omni tool. Or I could have just swum in. But now I have to contend with all this crap uh, upstairs. And there's no way to disable security cameras without getting to the computer. Which we can try, I don't know. Just exploring, guys. Just trying to check out where the hell we're supposed to go. So there's a camera there. Vent here. That just leads here. Where's the fucking camera controls? There doesn't seem to be any camera controls. Really? There's no computer station or something? Uh, you know what? 
Let's go ahead and load. Uh, yeah, I would like to load, thank you. This is not the plan of attack I wanted, really. Alright, let's explore these vents further. I think maybe we took a wrong turn. God. Fantastic. That was really great. So glad that happened to us. Sure were. Now leave me alone. I have so much ammo, guys. If you don't start being nicer to me, I'm going to be tempted to use it. Agent Navarro already found the Ambrosia and secured the area. Your orders are to proceed with the operation at Hell's Kitchen. Well, fuck you too, then. Do I have a save before all this nonsense? Because this just paces my off. I just want to know what's in here. If there's a camera control, maybe we'll check it out. I don't know. Yeah, I think I might let a save before all this nonsense. This was a waste of time. Yeah, here's the camera controls. Here's a nano key. Explosives, med kit, security computer terminal, personal computer terminal, locked, okay. Commander uh, Grimaldi, we liberated two canisters of the stuff along with the Ambrosia during the Liberty Island raid, but none of our people are quite sure what it is or what to do with it. Possibly a biological or chemical agent, but without the proper people and equipment, there's no way to tell. But Bet have suggested we keep one canister and a barrel of Ambrosia here as a con contingency. The rest was shipped out to the airfield an hour ago. Killian. Okay. Good to know. Um, is there anything stupid I can get rid of right now? What will this do? I'm going to go ahead and use it. Yeah. Heal two points, heal two points. Okay, fantastic. Drunk, but at least I can pick up another Aug canister. Fantastic. Um, icebreaker ready. Let's try it. Hope we have enough time to disable the cameras. Cycle tunnel doors. Walk out. And napalm canister. I don't think I'm going to be needing that. But these guys are really trying my patience on the non the no kill run. Camera status on. Turn it off. Actually, camera status on. Can I target the gut now? We'll just turn it off. 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 Log out. All cameras deactivated. Fantastic. Now we might actually be able to stealth these guys. I don't know how useful that's going to be right now. Uh, let's go ahead and make another hard save. We've made some mistakes here, but I, I think we can come back from it. I gotta say, weapon switching is a little tiny bit obnoxious. That it takes that long. So much 10 millimeter ammo. Rockets, no thank you. Med kit, I'll, I'll take for sure. You know, we noticed there was nothing down there that I needed, so what was the point? Um, and I think this just goes. Yeah, this just goes over there, so I don't need to mess with that. So we found the Ambrosia. Uh, I should have just gone to the security office first. Um, so, you know, that's shame on me for not exploring properly. Um, and I remembered the thing about the soda machine. I didn't realize it was a different kid. OK. 
Okay, I really hope that, you know what, this might be showing up in the recording. So actually, I'm going to stop this part of the recording right here and then start recording again in a minute. So let's make another hard save because I've got this stupid notification that's just not going away. So. Okay, I confirmed we are recording. The recording has started good. That looks fantastic. We're going to go back to Deus Ex. Gonna full screen it. Okay, load game, load our most recent game. Okay. Sorry, guys. Yeah, the last. Uh, I think we missed like a few seconds here. But the last part of the um, uh, let's play, uh, we uh, because I have to run it in windowed mode for OBS to not freak out. I have located the barrel of Ambrosia myself. I'm aware. Um. Anyways, because of that. Uh, there's issues when recording, and then typically for full screen applications, even if I get um, notifications, they're supposed to disappear, but it just wasn't going away, and it was driving me insane. So I decided, let's. Uh, that's how I got in last time. There's got to be a way to disable those uh, lasers, though, so I can just use the normal entrance. Good work down there. Thinking maybe it's in one of these buildings. Well, you know, since there's no one there, let's go through the lasers. I don't know if it's going to kill anybody, but we'll see. If it trips the TNT, we're screwed, which it most likely will, but we'll see. No idea. Can't believe there's no control for it here. Is there anything behind there that maybe controls it? We can try. Nope. <laughs> okay, that was a bad idea. I don't want to crawl through all these vents and stuff again. Uh, I can't believe there's no way to disable the lasers. That's pure insanity. Alright, well, we're just gonna... It's not too bad going this route. Tell me, these AUG quick buttons are not endearing themselves to me. If I could remap them, that's fine, you know, but I can't. I put that on F for flashlight or, or something, but it's not. And there's no way to disarm them. Hmm. Redanculous. Alright, so now we're gonna go back. Now we're going to go try and rescue that guy in the sewer. We opened up the, uh, in the previous part of this. I, I think I'm going to group these together into one episode. Maybe about three hours, three, four hours, something like that. Okay, let's go ahead and make a new save. Go ahead and quick save. Excuse me. Quick save. Seems to be a recurring issue there.
Really? God damn it, dude. Wasting all my ammo. Like a jackass. There's another one down there. Gotta be careful. Ugh. Now that's an alarm, I believe. Yeah. Really? What in the... Okay, hold on. We're gonna load game. That was ridiculous. I'm not wasting all that... Excuse me, actually... Oh, fuck. Did we save after we knocked that guy out? No, we didn't. Checking it out. Now we just gotta wait for, for some reason, we have to wait for the reticle to go. There we go. Uh, let's load that. Because that was three on one guy. Sergeant, is that you? Has to be in the back and it has to be a closed reticle, I believe. There we go. That's just two. Got some more 7.62 ammo, and let's go ahead and save, and reload. Such a nice guy. Ridiculous. I understand it's the RPG aspect of it, but still, come on! Bioelectric cell, very nice. 762 ammo from security to J Stewart MJ12 chemical insertion uh, our security grid is now online and active we will perform a thorough system uh, test every 12 hours to ensure integrity in expectation of the shipment from Hong Kong if you'd like to monitor our status you can access the grid with the login MJ12 I'm just confirming that there my reticles in the way uh, MJ12 and password coup d'etat Okay, so we got M, excuse me, that's the wrong sheet. MJ12, coup d'etat. Okay. All right, so we're gonna go, uh, let's save real quick. Okay, we're gonna go over here, check out this panel, see what we can control. Okay, let's see, MJ12 and, uh, coup. It's just COUP, right? Uh, day TAT. Security, camera status off, door status open, door access unlocked. Camera two, west entry, camera status off. Camera three, west entry, target status. Ooh, I'm so tempted. So tempted. Nah, I'll keep it. Nope, just, just bypassed. Bypassed, camera off. Yeah, that's what we'll do. MJ12 uh, Coupe de Zot okay. Rotate Bridge another save because we're gonna probably have to pepper spray this guy okay. 
We just run at him. Come on. There we go. What a waste. Oh my god. Okay, reload. God, all they have is 762 ammo. You guys suck. Let's go back to this thing. Probably need to reload this. Yeah, let's go ahead and reload it. Okay. Actually, we don't need anything right now. Let's go ahead and make a hard save here. I'm just thinking about the later parts of the game. Oh crap. Oh crap, we're so screwed. Yeah, we don't have a hazmat suit. We can't get to this stuff. This is all contaminated with chlorine. Alright, let's go ahead and load game. Alright, so, we're gonna try and get in here. I didn't see anyone else on the camera, so I think we're okay. I do feel like, what, uh, such a stealthy bastard right now. want that, but can I grab it? Yes, I can. Oh, no, it's napalm. I don't care. It looks good. Hmm, what is the code? I didn't get... another security panel right there so let's go ahead and make another hard save we're gonna try and make it to the security panel ah shit. I thought he would keep the door open at least we were able to take care of him one tool we only have three left let me okay let's go conversations We'll try 3316, I'm pretty sure it's not it. Damn it. Hmm. So if you had environmental resistance, you could sneak through the gas there. I'm not sure that's a good idea. Ah, we can go over there. Yes, 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 yes. I think that's what we'll do. Let's go ahead and quick save again. And let's go ahead and quick load again. Because <laughs> I fell into the sludge. Okay. I guess I would like to load. Thank you very much. Okay. I gotta tell you guys, I am enjoying uh, this playthrough of Deus Ex so much more. Um, but I am a little concerned that my particular playstyle is going to start making it pretty difficult here uh, in a little bit. I, I'm thinking of a couple of levels coming up that could certainly be pretty tough. Security board code. Okay, I need to go back up here and make sure that, that we didn't miss a security code in one of the emails or the data uh, cubes or whatever. Okay, here's the data cube. Our security grid, the system, MJ-12, coup d'etat, for 12 hours to ensure. All right. Let's try here. MJ-12, coup d'etat. Rotate bridge. Security.
special options. Log out. Okay. Cancel. Okay, so. I have no idea how you're supposed to get that. How the hell are you supposed to get that? Maybe if the water level rises, you can try and... Alright, well, I don't know why we're pussyfooting around this. We have quick saves. We have a couple of Omni tools. Let's start using our stuff, guys. Oh, what is this? Ah, security control terminal that was cleverly hidden. Okay, MJ-12. Okay. It's the same control console. Unlocked. Door status. There we go. Yeah, I, did, I guess I didn't even see that the last time. Oh shit. Oh my god, I feel like Catherine Zeta-Jones. Okay. Very nice. Nicely done. Deftly, deftly. Well, I'm not going in there. Well, we did just quick save, so. We were prepared to use one of these anyways. I need a shop in this game. That's what I need. Bypass the device. Okay. Code, entry code is 2167. Throne. Okay, details. Offers level Throne 6G will not interface with the local authorities, UNACO, or any government agencies. You are to act with prejudice against the threat to a mission objective. Okay. Med kit, 762 ammo. 762 ammo. Salt rifle. Two multi tools, two lockpicks. We're back to three multi-tools. Let's go ahead and make a new hard save. I don't know what's over there. I don't think it matters right now. No. Okay. Can't believe I'm not getting more XP for some of this stuff. Two, one, six, seven. This area is an old water treatment facility. I wonder what all these paramilitary types are doing down here. But considering what the smuggler said, I would imagine this is where they're holding his friend, Ford Ship. Okay, camera status off. Door unlocked. Open. Off. Unlocked. Open. Status off. Make another hard save here. Alright, let's see what we can do with these gentlemen, shall we? Oh my god! Hello? That's it. Whoever's out there is in serious trouble. Oh, that was a waste. Let's try it. Come on! Jesus. That was a lot of people to kill. Or knock out. Man, I'm so screwed for the mission. The actual mission. I'm wasting all this time on the everything else. Okay. Let's make another hard save. That was a lot of resources for just a few guys. Okay. Uh, from Data Administration to J. Stewart, MJ12 Chemical Insertion. Access codes have been changed. Your new access code is J. Stewart. Okay, we got J. Stewart. 
uh, J five one or oh, J S one three five seven. Those. I wish they'd picked a different font. J S one three five seven. Be sure to change the password after you log on. All right, cool. Jacob's Shadow by Andrew Hammond, Chapter Twelve. A lot of people say this city looks like hell. Ali said. <laughs> I just read that like a noir crime detective. A lot of people say this city looks like hell, Allie said. She took a long drag on her cigarette. The glowing tip burned a hole in the darkness. Most people are ne most people never been to hell, Jacob said. She looked at him, and he could s hear the smile in her voice. And I suppose you have? Jacob said nothing, and then stood and walked to the bed. Allie let out a small noise and shrank back against the pillows, as if she claw her way into them if she could. He leaned down close to her ear. You like to play games, he whispered, and that's fun. But you don't want to be playing games with me, because I'm the one honest man in this city. You should know that, since we were married. <laughs> Ridiculous. The man who was Thursday, we already read that one. Uh, unconscious. Don't have enough to pick up the assault rifle. Don't have enough to pick up the assault rifle. Okay, wait. Uh, let's go ahead, and it's what, Jay Stewart? Yeah. Jay Stewart. And I guess there is like a PDA where you can access all this stuff, but I just find it easier to. Sorry, I, gotta, I'm, I can't see my keyboard. It's so dark. <laughs> all right, there we go. WS, our chemist. From WS to J. Stewart, the chemist. Your concern about his behavior is unwarranted. However, once the initial trial is completed, you may eliminate him at your own discretion. Operation Central. From Op Central to everyone. Subject. Company Picnic. The company picnic, picnic has been moved from July 21st to July 28th. Please note, this is on your calendars. Employees on duty and other otherwise available will receive a bonus as compensation instead. See you there, Harleen Quinzel. Hmm. Um, look at that reference. Hmm. Human Resources Director, Operation Central, Harleen. A frown is just a smile turned upside down. Uh, from Central Security to Jay Stewart, Subject System Hacking. We've had several attempts to hack into the main data system. Most amateur tunneling stunts that don't require prejudicial response. Most, mostly amateur tunneling stunts that don't require prejudicial response. However, in keeping with standard protocols, all level one lock system codes have been changed. The new code is 2167. This will work within the complex, but it isn't valid for exterior access to those exterior act. Those systems are on a separate grid, as is the armory. Pass the code on to those with the proper clearances. Archie Rainman. Uh, Central Security. Never blame malice for what can adequately be blamed on stupidity. R. Feynman. Uh, from WS to J. Stewart, subject delivery. The main shipment will be arriving shortly, so ensure that all chlorine delivery tests are completed. Your recommendation of the water treatment facilities for insertion has also been approved. Your studies of vector diffusion and initial casualty counts were persuasive. Hmm, okay, so MJ-12 seems to be behind the poisoning, the chlorine pump dump, uh, in the river. Interesting. Let's go ahead and save. I'm not sure it's the best place to save, but we'll see. Okay, we took out everyone here. Don't have room for the assault rifle. See, that is a huge oversight that you can't just pick up bodies unless, let's check our settings, keyboard and mouse, unless there's a dedicated pick up body button. No. One thing I'm gonna try is this. I'm gonna try holding it. Or double click, no. Yeah, the fact that you can't pick up bodies if you can't empty their inventory into yours is kind of horseshit. We can check settings, game options, glory level subtitles, crosshair, player bog, or timeout value, player bob enabled, okay, all augs, crosshairs visible, subtitles on, glory level normal, weapon auto reload enable, object names. Okay, that's it. There's not much I can do here. Bioelectric cell. You know what, we should just go ahead and use one of those. This is where the person on the team who was like, we need to have environmental resistance was, you know. You must be Ford Shed. There we go. Who are you? Smuggler sent me. Who's holding you here? I don't recognize the uniforms of the soldiers. I don't know. They're private security for a biotech company or something. They had me doing antibody work. 
Corporate security isn't usually outfitted to fight a ground war. They're doing experiments on people. They don't want anybody finding out. Wait here while I deal with security. Tell me when the coast is clear. Yeah, I'm not sure everyone's uh, uh, incapacitated yet, so. Nanotechnology for stupid people. Feel like a moron because folks sling around words like universal constructor, gray goo, uh, mechanocarbons, or bucky tubes. Well, no longer. Nanotechnology for stupid people will guide you through the small, small world of tiny machines. Why is that important? Why should you care? Imagine a million microscopic robots no bigger than a red blood cell constantly securing or scouring your arteries for plaque and cholesterol. Imagine a supercomputer the size of your thumbnail that can record everything you see and hear. Imagine buildings that assemble themselves overnight. Well, imagine no longer. Actually, the gray goo is an issue in uh, the sequel. It's one of the weapons of mass destruction this terrorist uh, organization is using. The future is here, or will be soon, and it's made of little atoms. That's right. Atoms, the building blocks of all matter in the universe. Nanotechnology simply pushes the little building blocks around to make new, interesting, exciting things. Even now, scientists worldwide are making huge strides in perfecting the universal constructor that will make a nanotechnological future possible, but already the benefits are being reaped from their research. You'll learn the history, the inside scoop, the buzzwords, and what the future holds, all inside nanotechnology for stupid people. Stupid people, when you don't have two neurons to rub together. Uh, check out other books including the best-selling Pandemics for Stupid People and Cooking Dog for Stupid People. Wow. Once again, very relevant for uh, just everyone right now, the Pandemics for Stupid People and uh, Cooking Dog for our friends in Venezuela. Get I'm, I'm gonna deal with, while I deal with security. Just everyone chill the fuck Tell out. Tell me when the coast is clear. Corn and water treatment report for the New York City Council 2053. So we're in the 2050s, somewhere in there. On the other hand, opponents claim chlorine compounds can cause cancer, infertility, and birth defects. However, recent research indicates that the increased risk of cancer from chlorinated water is minimal or non-existent. For example, a 2043 toxicological study found no carcinogenic effects at chlorine concentrations a thousand times higher than the EPA. I'm just going to abbreviate that. Revised uh, Kyoto Standards. And the International Agency for Research on Cancer concluded population studies on cancer rates were too flawed to draw any conclusions. Man, where have you heard these kind of uh, claims before? Water chlorination is just one target for some activists. They advocate eliminating some or all of the 15,000 chlorine compounds now in use. This would uh, include most plastics, almost 85% of pharmaceuticals, and 96% of crop protection chemicals. Uh, yet most of the chlorine in the world occurs naturally. The annual global emission of some 100 or 1,500 naturally occurring chlor chlorinated organic chemicals totals 5 million tons compared to human emissions of chlorine compounds of only 26,000 tons. Hmm, interesting. This is a very crummy lab. And there's like almost nothing in it. Alright, so let's go ahead and make a hard save here. <clears throat> Unconscious. Uh, did we try and move him already? Yeah, can't pick up the assault rifle. Okay, what is this? Security keypad. Uh, two, one, six. Oh, shit. It's secure. Yeah, I figured that. Um, well, what the hell? I didn't read anything about uh, that one there. Let's check this data cube again. Five, seven, nope, nothing in there. I usually notice things like that though, so JS1357, JS1357, ah, oh, once the initial, okay, operation central, 2167, See if there's a data cube hiding under one of these beds or something.
Okay, we're gonna try it. No, he doesn't, for some reason, he doesn't have access to the uh, security panels right here. So, well, let's go ahead and save and uh, we'll use one of these. Determine if it's worth it or not. Ooh. Okay, we got a new prod. I do not want the, what is this? This is a law, I do not want that. 762 by 51, that's 308. Rockets. Right, oh, I found a right prod. I guess it gave me ammo for the right prod. I hope I don't have two right prods in my inventory. I guess I do. Well, no, I don't. Yeah, it probably just gave me ammo. That's probably a good thing. Let's see, yeah, two out of five, or three out of five, I mean. 12 gauge buck, buckshot, you can always have a little bit more of that. Electromatic pulse grenade, finally some EMP grenades. Oh, there we go, scramble grenade, gas grenade. Uh, I'm gonna make some room for that scramble grenade, that could be useful. Let's get the med kit here. 10 mil ammo, might as well. I guess you already have enough of that type of ammo. I can't believe I don't have enough uh, 10 mil ammo. I'm gonna take these rockets because they don't take up space in the inventory. Um, and we're gonna go ahead and get rid of something here. What is it gonna be? Let's just drink the wine. I think I can buy some from the lady if I absolutely need it for like a quest or something. I'll be a little drunk for a minute, that's fine. Let's go ahead and make another hard save. I think the coast is clear. We're gonna go ahead and save the game. Let's get out of here. Yeah, it's fine. Make a break, Make a break for, it. for it. I'll protect you. Here I go. Kind of curious where he's going. Let's go ahead and uh, make another hard save and go back to Smuggler. Uh, let's also check our side objectives. So, goals notes. Secondary goals none. Find NSF secrets generator. Okay, so we did all the side objectives for the game. Oh, 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 oh. Careful with those ladders. We gotta rotate the bridge back. Here we go, MJ12, recruit, to tat. Rotate the bridge. Now, I hope Smuggler, instead of just telling me like three things I can buy that I can easily find in the environment basically anywhere. I hope instead of that, he will actually give me access to, like, an actual shop this time. But we'll see. I don't know. I don't know for sure. And this didn't connect to the other place at all, so we're actually going to go down here and see if there's just, like, a... Maybe there's, like, a storeroom with some gadgets we can buy. I hope it doesn't... Did we, wait, did we come? Hold on. I think I know where this is. Uh, yeah. And there's nothing here that we don't already... Yeah, okay. So we're good. That's just another way in. Okay, so this was the way. Alright, cool. Alright, let's go talk to Smuggler. Word? Bloodshot. Nice. Why is the elevator not... Did I not come out through the elevator? It's like, I'm pretty sure I came up through the elevator last time to get out of here. But maybe I was mistaken. K-1 
Okay, once again, they didn't spawn the elevator with me. I'm just gonna go ahead and press the button so that it's here. Curiouser and curiouser. I got your friend out. Boyd, is he all right? Fine. You were right about those troops. Definitely not NSF. They're the CIA. They capture people and use them for medical experiments. I wouldn't go that far. You said you'd make it worth my while. Since you helped Ford, I'll cut you a deal. I'll give you a scope that will fit most handguns and rifles for 700 credits, a bioelectric cell for 250, or some light amplification goggles for 1125. Those goggles could come in handy, but I think I'll take the scope. I'll take the scope for 700. You'll have to drop something if you want to carry that. Hold on. I'll drop some gear. Hey, and thanks again for finding Ford. No problem. Uh, no, I can't take that, so what am I going to drop? Hmm. Like I said, first of all, <clears throat> believe it or not, I think I'm going to put this here. I'm going to drop the crowbar. Yeah. See anything you like? I'll take the scope for steel. I'm still so screwed when it comes to the rest of the mission, but we'll, we'll, we'll see. I mean, we've persevered so far. We'll get through it. I've noticed in games like these, like the, there can be some growing pains in the very beginning where you don't have as many augs or skills or equipment or whatever, so. Alright, so what we're going to do, this can go on. Oh, look at this. I'm going to upgrade the Trank Dart with a scope. That's pretty nice. I just wish I had a shop where I could buy some fucking Trank rounds, but whatever. I guess I'll just go to hell. Alright, and um... There's the elevator. Let's go ahead and make another save. Uh, we're gonna check out the free clinic now. And you know what? Here's what we're gonna do too. We're gonna go to the soda and we're just gonna drink a shitload of it because we just need to. So. Helped a little bit. We're still not feeling super great. Um, I wanna go talk to that girl's father. Also, hopefully he's got some more water in his office that I can, come here. That's right. I know it was supposed to be a no-kill run, but uh, they don't they don't count. <laughs> Who is this? I should probably go find her. Oh, I don't know. Okay. Yeah. Maybe she'll come in from the fighting. It's out of water. Okay. Well, the game remembered that it's out of water. Fantastic. Hooray! <laughs> Uh, now let's go to the free clinic, and then finally we will take out the guys on the tower there. I, I do remember that one being kind of tough, so we'll see how how well that goes. I don't know. I'm not going to promise anything. Let's go ahead and save. All clear. What a gloomy, ugly place. And turn the lamp on, it's so dark in here. cops are running scared. Reminds me of Washington. I was there when the NSF overran Squall Nomi, back when they were called. I, uh, I heard a lot of shooting outside. They told me to come in here. Sorry, I ain't got no- Hey there. I'm Raphael. This here's Jake. Hey. Sorry? Who what? Just call me when the shit Christ. You see the guy begging? Welcome to Tenderloin Clinic. Hmm. Alcoholism, substance abuse, chemical dependency. It's kind of all lumped into the same thing, but okay. Um. Please proceed to the examining room. 
Why do I have to go to the exam room? Okay. It's all ice cream and lollipops. That's what the nice man on TV said. Damn, these people are fucked. If you think you have gray death, please pick up an information packet. Don't worry, I'll wear my mask. Their medication <laughs> to their homes at no additional cost. Ah, yes. Okay, that's enough of that. Anything in here? Anything at all? Look at this. I like how with ray tracing now, everyone's just like, Oh, look at this new feature. And it's like, no, it's a feature that was removed. Look, it doesn't seem to have any sort of resource cost on the game. I wonder if this is lethal or not. I'm gonna have to look that up. See one of the doctors to purchase treatment. Hi, I'm in charge of law enforcement on this block. You doing alright? Yeah. They told me to come in here. Is that okay? Perfectly fine. Just making sure everyone's safe. Hey, while you're at it, you ought to do something about the NSF. Perfectly good shelter. You know what they're doing in this neighborhood? Kicked us out of the old Osgood place. A bunch of us camping in the tunnels. Talk about rights, but when they want something, they <clears> take <throat> it. Maybe I'll look into it. You take care of yourself. Note received. Check data vault for details. Okay, so goals, notes, secondary, none. Play completed goals. Nice. Wait, I think one of them's incomplete. Completed, completed, completed. Oh, I guess I get I got points for the finding the barrel, even though she found it first. Heal one point images, conversations, goals, notes, skills. Okay. At least they've got this nice little I forget what these are called. Uh, these like when the buildings have this square inside so you go outside. I don't know what that's called. My wife says they're called something. I, don't, I just forget what you have the plague. Nah, cops ran us off the streets. Usually <clears throat> I go into the water tunnels in the warehouse district, but somebody boarded up the window. You live in a tunnel? Actually, I like to stay on the roof of this big apartment building. Nice view. It's not too cold. There's a freight elevator at the end of the tunnel. Where's that window you were talking about? It's a basement window in the park south of the hotel. Not now. When the weather changes... <laughs> Who will help the widow's son? <laughs> they said the she bum was me. too heavy to lift. Oh, sorry, I, I thought you were someone else. The NSF are playing right into our hands. One of the doctors can help you. Ooh. Hey, whoa, 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 let me in there. Four tools. I'm gonna break in and get the code. You look like the do-it-yourself type. How about the automated care plan? Only 2,000 credits. Med kits are 300, but if you want augmentation work, you need the bots. Never mind. As you wish. I thought this was supposed to be a free clinic. I, I would like to go back outside and verify that, but actually, first thing what we're gonna do is we're gonna, we're gonna deus ex this problem. I'm gonna go in here, I'm gonna hack her terminal. Uh, I'm just gonna look quickly through her files for any sort of a uh, password change. I'm gonna break into the friggin uh, medical room and use the augmentation bot and start buying some augs for myself. Okay, do 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 sunlight breakthrough again. There were some stretches in Texas. Get a lot of rest staff. We'll make do. Apologies. There were some some wounds, Alfred. Okay. Okay. I guess not. I guess we're not gonna DSX this problem. We've got automated care for two thousand. Never mind. As you wish. I want those augs. Let me check my inventory. I still have... Wait, hold on. Augmentation upgrade canister. Augmentation canister. Uh, can add aquang environmental resistance. No, thank you. Must be used on augmentation screen. Oh, it's an augmentation upgrade. I see. Increase moderately. Tech 1. I have one. 
moderately significantly. Agents are inhumanly strong. An agent is inhumanly strong. Uh, uh, I don't know if I want to upgrade that yet. You must pay the doctors in cash before treatment can begin. <gasps> ah, we're not done yet. I want satisfaction. We've done all that we can. It's time for you to go. This is supposed to be a free clinic. But you do something if I had more money. You've got the plague, sir. You know, rich people don't get great death. Don't make me cold security. Like Mr. Billionaire Bob Page. He don't have it. The president don't have it. I never seen a movie star who's got it. You don't have it. Wait your turn. You should be more appreciative. By helping you, this gentleman risks his own health. But he won't give me any medicine. Trust me. When there's a cure, the city will underwrite the cost. The virus threatens everyone. I don't believe you. And I won't hesitate to prescribe the treatment for you. You better not. Thank you. The ones with the plague can be so stubborn sometimes. Don't I wonder why. Me. Let me express my gratitude. You can have the automated care plan for 1200 That's at a 40% discount. Or a med kit for 180 Never mind. Suit yourself. Fuck you, I'm still gonna steal from you. Okay, dead body. I have such respect for the dead. I'm just hoping one of them has something. I mean, besides the disease. Three picks? What the hell is that? I don't even know what that is in there. Turning on your lamps. This line has been shut down. Even the doctors can't afford fucking telephones. Vectors. The vectors are all wrong. I guess this guy knows something about uh, immunology or um, what is it called? The study of diseases. Yeah, you guys know what I'm talking about. Uh, grave times. Uh, drown the ceremony of innocence party in the blood. Blood Dimmed Tide, Lose All Conviction, featuring Oblivion, Petty and Twisted, Tire Tire, DJ VLW, The Gibson, huh? Oh, it's busy, alright. Uh, and Brewer's Phase, March 17th, 100 credits, location, under neck, blah blah blah, no guns, no knives, no morals, no thing, nowhere, no cops, everything is permitted, nothing is free. Everything is permitted, nothing is free. That reminds me of the Assassin's Creed motto. Everything is permitted, nothing is true. Something like that. Um, and uh, obviously it's probably some, some from some sort of like... This account has been locked, pending investigation. Some sort of conspiracy theory or thing in history or something that, uh, I don't know, the, the Freemasons said or something like that, so... Board last week's supply, do what you can. Uh, blah 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 blah. Non existence. We'll make do. So much to take care of yourself, right? Uh, okay, well, I guess I can't force my way in here just yet. But, um. Alright, well, we checked out the free clinic. Not much going on here. I wish to hell they'd give us the all clear. Goal accomplishment bonus. What the hell is that? Logs. Goal accomplishment bonus. Okay. Uh, goals notes. Display completed goals. Man named Johnny took a woman who went alley. Investigate the hostage situation. Talk to the locals in the bar or clinic. Clues the location of the generator. Locate the stolen. Okay. Weird. I don't know what I did. Game seems to be pretty happy with it. Pretty impressed with me. All right, now we're going in with not much. We may have to break our. I'm gonna break my one rule. Uh, we may have to go in and and break our rule and actually uh, merc some motherfuckers. But I'm hoping we don't have to. We'll see. I think I like the elevator the best because we can get right at that guy, or we can bypass him by going through the alley. I don't know. 
haven't decided. Oh yeah, bioelectric cell right here. That's pixel perfect accuracy right there. I think we got yeah, we got everything in here. So we don't need to mess around with that anymore. Let's go ahead and go down here. Two tools left, but 3316, I believe, is the code in case we didn't hack this one already. Yep. Okay, good. So we, at least we saved some tools. like to just get around these guys like I did in the first level. We could try that. And I didn't even see this before, so we could always try this as well. Yeah. Oh, blimey. Whatever. Screw you. Alright, let's just load. I think we are going to have to take that guy out regardless. Let's go ahead and make another... Why can't I save when you're talking? It's so stupid. Shut up. Shut up. There we go. <laughs> it's so weird. You can't save while they're talking. It's so dumb. Come on, come on, buddy, come on. There we go. There we got six ammo. All right, fantastic. Let's go back downstairs. Okay, thank God we didn't lose health from that. So I'm just gonna quick save because get. I think we made a hard save just there. So let's go ahead and we're gonna reload this so that we're ready to rock. Should anything need to be rocked. Let's hope he doesn't see me. I don't know if this was the right way to go or not, but we'll, we shall see. All right, let's go ahead and quick save. I don't know where he went. Where did he go? Oh shit. Oh my god. <laughs> that guy was insane. Alright, I need fucking. Uh, I need fucking uh, tranquilizer darts so I can hit people at range. You know? They've been so stingy with them recently in the, in the game. Could just try and circumvent all these guys. Let's go ahead and make another. 
save here, and then a uh, quick save too, and then let's just see what we can get away with. First off, let's go up here. I swear, I uh oh. I may need to upgrade uh, melee weapons because this is getting ridiculous. I said four. Let's make another hard save. Oh, thank you. 762 ammo. Because I'm, you know, I absolutely need it. Oh, there's another guy there, another sniper there. Screwed. What the hell is this? Looks like a texture from Thief. Hmm. I wonder if there's a way in there from over here. Let's make another hard save. Yeah, because the reason I keep hard saving is I don't know the layout of this level very well. I keep feeling like I, I'm gonna uh, fuck it up or that I'm backing myself into a corner here, so I just want to avoid that if possible. Well, that's it. Gosh. All proud members of the NSF, our time is fast approaching. What we are always fearing is upon us. Have no doubt. We are fighting against our own imminent slavery. But you are brave. You are strong. We will triumph. A temporary office has been arranged in the warehouse basement for the coordination of equipment, armament, and other supplies. We request that each member report to the office to be fitted with a telemetry rig prior to proceeding to your assigned post. The code is 9923. Okay, we'll give that a look-see. Guy's still doing his thing. Let's see if I can't break the window here and get down there. Right. And I really need to look up if this is um, non lethal because I would love to have access to some non lethal. Ammo list, whatever. If I can just knock people out with this stupid thing. Nice med kit. Can't carry any matter of those. If I can't, then you know what I'm gonna do. Uh, let's go to health. Okay, I'll just heal everything. There we go. Find a new med kit.
Where are all these metal crates coming from? It's so weird to have metal crates. Okay. Let's go ahead and, um... I guess we'll make a quick save. Okay. Let's just try and roll with what's happening here. Okay, here we are. Some ammo down there. Okay, that should be far enough away from those guys. Let's go ahead and save again. Sorry guys, it's getting a little intense. I'm having to focus on what we're doing here. How am I going to do with these guys? Oh my god, dude. Holy shit, can't believe that worked. Oh god damn it. Oh my god, okay. Health. Jesus, that did not go well. Okay, let's make a hard save. And uh, let's call it Jesus. You may remember the name of this save from uh, uh, the Thief Gold playthrough. I don't have enough slots to pick up that whatever. Okay. Trank Dart, thank Christ. Yeah. I like how the only blood on the floor is mine. Trank dart again. Okay. I'll hit some of these guys later, I think. First off, let's try this. He should pass out in a second here. Oh, shit. So screwed. Oh 
shit. Go upstairs. Go. No, no, no. Fuck. I can't go upstairs. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Leave me alone. Just all pass out, please. Please pass out. Please pass out. Please go to sleep. Go to sleep. Whoever's left. Oh my god. Holy shit. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Oh god. Okay. Oh my god. Come on. Come on. Oh shit. Nope. Oh my god. So many of them. Shit. God damn. They're just fucking me up. Alright. Uh, inventory. Let's go ahead and uh, equip. That's everyone. <laughs> Holy mother of cunts. God damn. Wrong button. What did they deign to give me in the one little supply crate there? Yeah, I did not. That did not go well. But like, once again, I'm trying to trying to do this non-lethally, not necessarily stealthily. I care more about the non-lethal aspect than the stealth, so. Good, Trank Darts. One out of one, didn't find anything, didn't find anything, didn't, I have enough. Didn't find anything, didn't find anything. I'm just, guys, I'm just double checking here. I apologize if that's annoying. Well, let's go ahead and quick save. Screw it. I mean, we're gonna have to do this at some point anyways. Uh, I do need to go buy some more med kits or something though, because I used quite a few doing this. By the way, everyone's unconscious, correct? Yeah, seems. Actually, let me go double check. Unconscious. 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 Oh, oh, oh. Unconscious. I should have used more of the gas grenades. I just uh, didn't, you know. Actually, you know what I could do? I could pause and equip it next time. That's probably better so that I can just have it without having to, like, panic and find the buttons. So that's what I'm going to do next time. I'm just gonna pause and equip. So everybody is unconscious, that's good. I don't know what skill increases my accurate, or my... Let's go ahead and check out skills, actually. Skills. Weapons, low tech. We kind of might want to get trained with that. I just don't want to waste to attack and sleep. Melee weapons such as knives, throwing of swords, pepper guns, and prods. Okay. Weapons, pistol. Oh, mini crossbow, so the pistol. Hmm, but that's 3150. I don't know if I want to do that. It's so hard to pick what my build's going to be. Yeah, I should have used more grenades. Well, the problem with the grenades is since I could get that rebreather long thing so that I can use gas grenades and then just, like, not have to worry about it. So I can throw gas grenades into a group of people and then just go uh, stun them all with the cattle prod. But, um... I think every time I've played this mission, it's a shit show. <laughs> every single time. I just, I don't think, you know, stealth doesn't work too well for Deus Ex, and this is one of the uh, horror mission designs, but there, there's other missions in the game that are just like, holy shit, you know? And it's a long game, guys. If I remember. If I'm remembering correctly. It is not a short jaunt in this game. 70 skill points. Let's get some... hell was that? Sounds like a med bot. <laughs> I just scared the shit out of myself. I was like, who's stalking me? Is this a horror game? 
Uh, two lockpicks. I might do that unless I can just unlock it from a terminal. Let's look for a security terminal. Don't see one. Let's look for this uh, personal computer terminal. NSF. What did we have? We wrote this down. It was NSF001. Right? Hmm. It's like a Schadenfreude, Manderley, Knight, Inaco. Is this on a different page? Or that was UNATCO 001. Steward MJ12. Well, let's check our... Hold on real quick. We're gonna check our goals and notes. No, conversations or lo... No, I don't know what we're gonna check. I think we just, I forgot to write that one down. We're kind of screwed. All right, so you wanna just hack it? Let's just hack it. out. I don't want to do that yet. If I need to maintain any more stealth. Oh, that's probably a better way up. Let me see where this... Oh, and shit, the dog. Alright, let me go ahead and load our most recent save. Holy mother of guns. Okay. Actually, no, let's load the quick save. I think that that occurs after this. Yeah. I think it was when I was like, okay, I'm ready to go down here now. Wait a minute. I needed to pick this up, didn't I? Yeah, if there's a medbot downstairs, we're gonna we're gonna avail ourselves of his services. Okay. No dogs. Couple of boxes. All right. Hear lasers. Hear walking. Don't want to mess with that just yet. Oh, that's the guy that I sniped. Sweet. That's awesome. sure I want to go in there. The, the lean buttons seem to have issues sometimes. So F12 on uh, Steam is a screenshot, I may have mentioned this before, and uh, it's just hilarious because um, I'm going to have a folder of like a thousand screenshots when I'm done with this game, because F12 is the quick save button as well. Okay, we have enough, to, okay, we're, we're fully stocked on ammo except for the friggin' Trank gun. Okay, 
Oh, here's a secret door. I don't know if I want to mess around down here. I don't see anything. Okay, there, here's a security booth. Maybe I do want to mess around down here. Okay, so... Camera off. Camera off. Camera off. I guess that's it for this. So we can go ahead and walk out. Log out. Lock out. Go. Grab this nano key. that I got a login for the NSF. Collateral damage, we need Unaco propaganda, kitchen, psycho so friendly fire casualties. Okay, good luck. Difficult, we can get zero to once nervous system there and then blah 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 tactical via couriers. Okay, no codes. Really? I don't know why that's automatically opening for me. That's a little suspect. I don't like that. And I want to shut down these damn things. What? Fuck you. I turned off all the cameras! Fucking bitch. You're seriously gonna tell me that there's cameras on a separate security? Oh my god. Here we go. Camera off. Camera off. They're all off. Alright, so these are the wrong ones. Maybe I can just say fuck it and go through these lasers? I mean, yeah, fuck it. Trying to determine if any of this was worth it. I don't think it was. Sorry guys, I know this is a total shit show, but I'm just trying to figure out, like, if there's anything down here worth having. And I don't think that there is, but if there is... Okay. Let's go ahead and load, uh... Where's the quick save? Let's load the quick save. Yeah, we didn't start doing any of that crap yet. Okay. I know it's sort of cheating, but uh, honestly, I have no idea what's down there. I don't think there's anything of value or use. I think that's just a different way to get in here. Um, we got a pretty easy method to deal with stuff right here. Oh, excuse me, this one. Okay, let's go ahead and hack her. Hack her right up. Shut down generator gloom. Okay, explosion imminent. I'm gonna go up to the roof. Good job, JC. The power just died at the NSF headquarters. Now it's up to Paul. Go to the roof. A chopper is arriving with Agent Herman on board. He will lock down.
kommt der Kermen. God help these people. Generator. How's the raid going? They should have sent Agent Navarre. Your brother is timid like a child. Did something go wrong? You do not need to hear anything from me. Take the helicopter back to base. I am sure Mandalay has planned a debriefing for the top agents. Okay, well, I'm out of here. I hope they took out those uh, feisty boys on the roof. No, they didn't. That's the guy that I bought like three beers for at the bar. Right? The one asking for beer. They don't want to fly one of these birds all wound up. They have a temperament, especially in a crosswind. Uh, I think I'm ready to go. We, we go. I've had enough of Hell's Kitchen. <laughs> They're still shooting at us. It's pretty cool, though. Liberty Island, New York City. Let's make a new hard save. We have made some progress. For sure. Is it still 451? Nope. Nice. Still is. What is this? Repair bot. Uh, recharge. Nice. So we don't have to spend any bio canisters. We can take more flares. I don't think we need them now. I'm going to turn on this lamp because I like to do that. I am wont to do that. Janie's bot specs and overview. Matsu Gravis R118 repair bot. The Matsu Gravis R-118 is characteristic of all bots of the MG repair line, an autonomous unit capable of a wide range of repair, maintenance, and construction tasks. By default, the R118 is equipped with a Kroya Searchlight 3 Argon laser attached to the standard MG IRL arm. Sharing optics and visual processing, a self-recharging bioelectric, bioelectric battery, wireless command control, and 16 gigabytes of internal memory. That must have seemed like a lot to them, and I'm actually it did, because I had 16 megabytes of RAM, I think, when this game came out. Of internal memory for a superior amount of task customization at an affordable price. The bioelectric interface adheres to the same light standards uh, pioneered by the MG and adopted by most other companies around the world, allowing all units of the R line to act as a mobile bioelectric recharges, rechargers if necessary. Go ahead and hack it. I think I wrote this one down too, but it's just easier to hack because I don't remember what it was. Uh, log out. I don't think we can do anything with this one. So we can't open this again. Actually, no, that's the one thing. Can we open the hatch? We cannot. As of this moment. That thing is down. Here's another lock pick. Very nice. So can we explore Liberty Island? Like, I don't think I've ever gone to anywhere on Liberty Island other than Unatco HQ after uh, finishing parts of the game. So yeah, the assault on the the thing didn't go super well, but I think the gas grade stun baton combo works pretty well for a non-lethal playthrough, at least right now. There has got to be uh, a shop. No, that's why. Because they lock it. Your mission was a success. Ooh, Just about the only bright side of the operation, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. Report to Manderley for a briefing. Mr. Dan. Yeah? The prisoners on level 3 are a sensitive matter. Leave the interrogations to Mr. Simons. You are authorized to receive your orders from Joseph Manderley, after which you will return to the helipad. Simons? You guys from DC? What agency? Please proceed to Manderley's office. We will expect to see you shortly. Hey. Do not question the prisoners yourself. Oh, that's exactly what I'm gonna do. We will be waiting. Don't like these guys. What a bunch of weirdos. Anna Navarra likes your style. <laughs> I bet you guys would make a nice couple. Ugh. Liberty Island is off limits. Those jerks from Washington think they own the place. Well, I'm sure they did pay for it, or at least a big substantial part of it. Uh, Mead Bucks Congress, APR Washington, D.C. Defying Congress for the third, third time this year, President Mead unilaterally paid the United States late dues to the United, it looks like 10 is removed. Oh, no, I already read this. I guess the tapers don't change? That's weird. Don't worry about what the guys are saying about Hell's Kitchen. Full ray tracing reflections. Take you think this. that's funny? I do think it's funny. 
You know what else I think is funny? Is this. I wouldn't do that if I was you. Well, I would. I would do that if I was me, because I am hey, me and I did do it. What the hell? Never should have transferred. What? You got nothing to say now? The warehouse. I'm sure you would have helped out with the firefight in front of the hotel. Well, I'm gonna hack your computer because I'm curious. What would... I'm gonna hijack your internet history and use it to blackmail you, so I can throw pots at you all day long, and you can't do anything. Impunity is my middle name. No email today. I know for a fact from when you were Nobody at the academy you. that you can do more than throw gas grenades and use a prod. They're full of it. That's cool. Here's oh, okay. Look at this. This is awesome. Because I went non-lethal in the mission and I didn't actually personally kill anybody. Don't worry about what the guys are saying about Hell's Kitchen. Don't worry about what the guys. Everyone's are saying pissed about at me for going non-lethal because they don't like the NSF. And the game acknowledges my actions during the mission. That's fucking awesome. Again, Deus Ex, pioneering, ahead of the time. In fact, I gotta write down the notes real quick. Um, Okay, I'm just writing down notes for my review. Uh, we're gonna go to the med bay. I'll probably eavesdrop then on his what's going on in his office. That's what I'll do. Now, here's the two t true testament of whether or not this is a true immersive sim. I decorated my office last episode. And we had better fucking find. Hold on. This wasn't unlocked before. Now I'm gonna go in here and steal everything. Fantastic. More trank darts. I need these. I'm taking this. I'm gonna put it in my office. Uh, I'm really enjoying myself right now, which probably means that we're not recording. <laughs> I swear. If we're not recording, oh my god. I'm gonna lose it. Damn it! <laughs> It was so, well, okay, we're just gonna have to redecorate. That's all there is to it. All there, wait, hold on. I'm going to eavesdrop. Not yet, actually. I'm gonna do my stuff. Block picks are for squares. What the hell's in here? Hello? I guess nothing, huh? Strange. What was it? Jay Denton? Uh, Bionic Man? Is it JC? What is the fucking. What is my password? What's my login? Nico J. Manderly. Is it JCD? And then Bionic Man? There we go. Okay, I need to write that down. JCD Bionic Man. Is there another notebook I was writing in yesterday? What's going on here? All right, so, J. Reyes, congrats. Congrats on surviving your first mission, JC. I know it's all part of the job, but I'm glad to see you back in one piece, more or less anyways. If you get this message before I get a chance to see you in person, then get your ass down here so I can patch you up. By the way, I hear a few things from up top and I get the impression that they were definitely taking advantage of this NSF attack to evaluate your performance. So far, everyone seems to be ecstatic, well everyone except for Gunther, but he's got his own problems. Keep it up, but keep an eye out too. I get the impression sometimes that everyone here has their own agenda. No. Watch your back, Paul Denton. Uh, I don't know much time, so I'm gonna have to cut this short. They're going to tell you a lot of things about what went on today, and it's probably all going to get pinned on me. Got my reasons, but I can't get into them right now. Not over the net. 
but you've got to trust me that there are reasons. Maybe I can point you in the right direction, tap a few computers, and see what you come up with. Try Mandalay's computer, if you can risk it. Uh, password is Night Killer. You might also check Navar's, but I don't have her password cold. Password, cold woman, be careful around her, and for that matter, everyone else. Yeah, I don't think I have Navar's password either. I'm gonna try and figure it out. Um, well, let's uh, quick save and go see what we can do. Righteous Angels, Perspectives on Unaco by Wendy White, Chapter 3, The New Seraphim. As the giddiness that uh, greeted the new millennium faded to grim apathy in the face of plague, famine, and the inevitable waves of national convulsions, uh, that followed in their wake, the United Nations found itself increasingly outmoded and unable to cope with the worldwide rise in terrorism. Tensions between the affluent, walled away within their private enclaves, and those less fortunate escalated rapidly as basic medical care facilities collapsed under the weight of, under the weight of each new outbreak. The very pervasiveness of the net fractured communities into smaller and smaller special interest groups. Actually, Ayn Rand warns about this, of one-issue voters um, splintering further and further and further and further until there's really no people are they don't have any sort of real political philosophy or political motivations they're just like i just want this the speedway on the highways to be a little bit higher five miles per hour higher and then that's all they care about and they lose sight of the grander political optics um and as local police grew increasingly ineffectual and access to deadlier weaponry more commonplace conflict spilled over national borders and onto the streets of major urban cities the United Nations was forced to admit that their own military was both outmoded and unequipped to deal with these threats, so a new organization was required, UNATCO, an army of seraphim, uh, divinely charged to meet, I think they meant meter out, it just says meet, M-E-T-E, -E. I think it's supposed to be meter, meter out impartial justice with burning wings and flaming swords. Huh, that's a little bit uh, crazy, the religious illusions that you're, you're drawing there, a little bit insane, and the religious imagery. I heard about the raid. Don't sweat it. I'm sure Paul had his reasons. Reasons for what? Something happened? Okay. Image Millennium Magazine added to data vault. Okay, images. Bob Page. Will Aquinas change the world? Future of business. Experts debate. World of unlimited bandwidth. Resurgence in world terrorism. Ambrosia was a non-organic compound containing eutactic, uh, eutactic components. I'm gonna look that up. I've never heard that before. I feel like I have, actually. Eutactic. What does eutactic mean? Non-comparable mathematics chemistry perfectly ordered. In mathematics, a eutactic, la a eutactic lattice is a lattice in Euclidean space whose minimal vectors form a eutactic, eutactic star. This means they have a set of positive eutactic coefficients such as c, c sub i such that the sum of c sub i squared such set of positive eutactic coefficients c sub i such that um, it just says equals the sum of c sub i squared where the sum is over the minimal vectors. That's not really helping. But of course I think this has to do with Perfectly ordered, uh, containing eutactic components, administered only in verified cases of great death. Uh, eutactic uh, chemistry. Let's look that up. Now that's eutectic. That's not what I want. Eutectic, eutectic, eutectic. I think no. Eutactic. Perfectly ordered. Here we go, tactic. Okay, there we go, tacticity. Um, yeah, adjacent chiral centers within a macromolecule, practical significance. Okay, so tacticity, tactic, macromolecules, eutactic, didactic or entactic macromolecules have more than one stereo isom isomeric atom per unit. Okay. So tactio acid. Yeah, I, I thought it had more to do with tacticity rather than eutactic. Polymers. In eutactic macromolecules, substituents may occupy any specific but potentially complex sequence of positions along the chain. Isotactic and syndeutactic polymers are instances of the more general class of eutactic polymers. Oh, okay. 
which also includes heterogeneous macromolecules in which sequence consists of a sub substituents of different kinds, for example, side chains and proteins. Alternate positions along the chain, a technical substituents are placed randomly along the chain. So atactic random uh, orientation of uh, functionalities on the polymer chain. Syndiotactic is uh, ordered opposition or ordered um, uh, arrangement. So basically like binary arrangement, like back forth. So a repeating pattern and then isotactic would be orientation all on the same side of the center, the chiral center, or just the same side of the chain. Um, eutactic polymer, I'm still not getting a eutactic macromolecule substituents may occupy any specific but potentially complex sequence of positions. Maybe it refers to the fact that the, the repeat unit on the chain is a repeat unit, but it could be sort of infinitely complex. I don't know. Uh, Liberty Island satellite photo. Okay. Gunther's full of it. Earlier tonight, in the statue, I bet you had at least half a dozen takedowns. At least. Oh, this is all happening in the same night? Holy shit. My character must be exhausted. Good to have you back. Uh, public access. Okay, I think these are all new. Stopping terror, a new perspective on freedom. When one maniac can wipe out a city with 20 of 20 million with a microbe developed in its basement, a new approach to law enforcement becomes necessary. Every citizen of the world must be placed under surveillance. <laughs> okay. Uh, they just cut right to the chase there. That means sky cams at every intersection, computer mediated analysis of every phone call. This is, here's the thing, this is kind of happening already. Again, this game is so prophetic and relevant to what's going on right now. Um, the NSA, as far as they know, they literally record and, and monitor basically every phone call, especially cell phone calls in the States. And they've been doing it and people just like, we're nobody's happy about it. That, that we just feel like, what are we gonna do? We just accept it. Um, Computer uh, email and, and snail mail and a purely electronic economy in which every transaction is recorded and data mined for suspicious activity. Uh, well, they are being data mined. I don't know if it's for suspicious activity. I think it's more to advertise to people better and get demographic data right now. But you can bet your ass the government's probably got its hands in that little pie too. We are close to achieving this goal. Some would say that human liberty has been compromised, but the reality is just the opposite. As surveillance expands, people become free from danger, free to walk alone at night, free to work in a safe place, and free to buy any legal product or service without the threat of fraud. One day, every man and woman will quietly earn credits, purchase uh, items uh, for quiet homes on quiet streets, have cookouts with neighbors and strangers alike, and sleep with doors open and doors and windows wide open. If that isn't the tranquil dream of every free civilization throughout history, what is? Anna Navarra, Agent Inaco. Jesus. Uh, that, as I discussed, that is, in my opinion, the central discussion of all political philosophy. Do you want dangerous freedom or peaceful slavery? That's the central argument. And um, true, what she says could potentially be true, but do you want to sacrifice the real freedom you have to make your own decisions um, and have your own privacy for something like this? And is this even achievable? That's really what polit the political discussion is typically about. Terrorism without uh, war without fonts. How do we fight an underground threat when with no defined territory base or often no leader? We look to military history. The casebook example of how to manage civil unrest is the Hamlet Evaluation System, HES, developed by the United States military during its occupation of South Vietnam in the 20th century. Since population centers in that country contained both communist rebels and loyal citizens, the towns were ranked on a scale from 1 to 5, 5 being the safest, the monthly reports of local commanders useful in Vietnam for maintaining contour maps of ideology concentration have provided many components of the UNATCO sector field report. The modern UDU, UNATCO deployed unit, has been modeled on the CAP combined action platoon deployed in Vietnam. I don't know if you'd want to model after that because they, you know, they I don't know if you remember this, but the US had to withdraw from Vietnam because um, we weren't making significant advancements or changes, much like uh, Afghanistan and Iraq. 
which by the way developers of this game who are writing this in the year 1999 god you have a lot to look forward to in the next 20 years uh to put in view, a 15-man rifle squad responsible for a single hamlet. CIP productive villages typically earned a 2.95 HET score compared to a 1.6 average in the same region. CIP units performed in many mission roles, but they primarily worked with indigenous police to strengthen ideological ties. Like CIP units, UNACO teams are primarily concerned with building safe communities. Joseph Menterly, director of UNACO. Man, the writing in this game is fantastic. It, first of all, it's prophetic, relevant, and it feels so real, too. And there's a lot of history and research, even for the kooky conspiracy stuff um, that went into this. And here we go. No, you're enemy Templars. There's some debate about whether the Templars should be considered ter a terrorist organization because they do not employ the typical tools of terrorism. But make no mistake, the Templars are just as dangerous as any other group that might use guns and bombs to intimidate the free citizens of a country. Only the Templars wield blackmail and extortion as their weapons. Supposedly the direct descendant of a so-called secret society with its roots in the medieval crusades, the present-day Templars are mainly concerned with increasing their own bank accounts and elaborately illegal financial manipulations that have left the entire markets collapsed in their- that have left entire markets collapsed in their wake. The Templars are currently classified as- and this is also stuff that's happening right now in the world. This is absolutely true. Um, I'm not gonna start dropping names and get all conspiratorial, but uh, there are definitely people who exist who uh, exhibit this behavior right now in the economies. And you could argue that potentially the big tech giants um, are sort of doing this as well, you know, they, they sort of became wealthy overnight and now rather than just be like, hey, I made a bunch of money, I'm gonna like go buy an island and retire and like sip, sip on margaritas. No, they seem to be more interested in, you know, advancing the political power and social power of their platforms and, and impacting history. And I just don't understand that thirst for power. Maybe it's because I don't own a multi-billion dollar company right now and I can actually buy off politicians and influence things myself to get the world the way I want it to be. Uh, maybe that's why I don't understand it, but I I would imagine me as a person, I just I wouldn't understand it regardless, even if I had because see, here's the thing, you know, I'm, I'm very much sort of a hedonistic, not in like a gross way, but like um, if I had a bunch of money, I would just live for the things that I enjoy. And I might help people too, you know, if I knew people that needed help or whatever, that's that's fine. I might give to charity, but I'm not going to like start trying to influence elections and, and you know, buy people off and blackmail people and all this shit. I, I have no desire to do any of that. I would just, I don't know, I would just keep doing stuff like this, you know, I have a channel where I just get to talk about games that I like that I think are really great. I don't know. Um... Uh, the Templars are currently classified as inactive after being successfully diminished by a combined UNACO slash Interpol raid on their Paris headquarters in 2051. However, several key Templar figures are still at large and may attempt to reform the organization under a new designation. X-51. Little is known about X-51 aside from their involvement in all manner of illegal research, most, much of it prohibited by worldwide concords over the last 50 years. Computer profiling shows a high likelihood that X-51 was responsible for the SoCal disaster that submerged much of Southern California. Though the exact nature of the experiment that led to the tragedy is still unknown, little other information is available on the overall objective of X-51, if any exists. X-51 is believed to, be led, believed to be led by Gary Savage, a scientist previously employed by the United States government for a variety of black projects, until he disappeared under mysterious, dark, mysterious circumstances several years ago. All agents are advised to be vigilant for any indications as to the whereabouts of Savage or other members of X-51 and report them immediately to their operator or immediate supervisor. Um, man, the U.S. is fucked in this game. Full of it. SoCal's underwater? Statue, they don't necessarily have an issue with that, but... <laughs> at least. They've got some kind of specialist from Washington downstairs. Somebody to... That looks like a Thomas Kincaid painting that my mom used to have. Let's get this. Get this. Hey, what the hell? I can read your book, bro. Do you know who I am? Do you have any clue who I am? I will wreck you. Uh, that's against protocol, agent. 
Because Yunako will often deal with situations that cannot easily be contained, agents may unfortunately need to interact with the press. If you are not trained for such interaction, do not, repeat, do not speak with journalists regardless of nationality. They are skilled in misdirection and propaganda. Refuse comment. Remember, security procedures are a first line of defense. Secrets save lives. Always refer to reporters, refer reporter at crime scenes to Yunako information officers and fact management teams. Fact management teams. That sounds a lot like uh, what we have going on these days. Fact management. Uh, I'm gonna go downstairs, check everything out. And also I'm gonna, oh, I should've hacked his computer to see if he has any info on Anna Navarre. <laughs> Come on, icebreaker. Let's go. No email today, damn it. Oh, I'm gonna go down here. Now I'm gonna deal with uh, getting chewed out. Carry on, agent. I'm gonna go in the ladies' bathroom again, see if he yells at me again. I will say, these bathrooms, they didn't impress me at first, but after going to Hell's Kitchen, uh, they are very clean. I mean, relatively. there's anything on Anna Navarre, it's going to be there. Uh, let's go to health. Heal all. Thank you very much. Augmentations. Contains Aqualung environmental resistance. I think environmental resistance is proving to be better. Um, yeah, let's go with that. Install. That's against protocol, Agent. Medical Management of Biological Casual Casualties Handbook, U.S. Army Medical Research Institute of Infectious Diseases. Um, in addition to their detrimental health effects on the targeted population, biological warfare agents will would likely cause significant impacts on the medical care system. Massive numbers of patients and demands for intensive care would overwhelm medical resources. Special medications or vaccines not generally available in standard pharma pharmaceutical stocks would be required. Medical care providers and laboratory personnel might need added protection and autopsy and in inter oh, interment of remains could present hazards not commonly dealt with. Human eye augmentation. I think we read this one. Just gonna hack it and see if he's got any information that he's been keeping from me. Ding 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 ding. Uh, mech aug uh, question. Blah blah blah. You know, while repairing mechanism, completely automatic shutdown of the field's vital systems. Obvious information mechanism thrown since further description. All subsequent. No, I don't think there was anything about Anna Navarre in there. Save. I want to see if I can break it open. <sighs> Guess not. I took a few hits tonight. The doc had to operate. We'll get well soon, soldier. Yes, sir. I will. Dr. Reyes said they took the bullet out, but I still feel it in my stomach. 
Thanks for talking to my friend. He admires you. I knew what I was getting into when I joined up. Come on. Uh, when you, uh, entity token MJ12 ambiguous expand, uh, work with the file. SH187 was very instructive. It had favorable return, consuming, we like blah, 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 Oracle. Okay, that was just on some M MJ12 info. I don't think it had anything to do with. Ah. 20% one tool. We already looked at Project Dibbuk last time. Steal his Omni tool, or multi tool, or whatever it is. Not enough light in here. Where the hell is Anna Navarre's off? Oh, I know where it is. It's Gunther's full of it. Earlier tonight, in the statue. I bet you had at least half a dozen takedowns. At least. What do I want darts for? Binoculars. Do I have binoculars? Oh, I have two sets of binoculars. I'm going to go ahead and drop one of these. I don't need more binoculars. Manderly says only senior staff members can interview the prisoners. I don't think you're supposed to be down here, Agent. Okay, that's unbreakable glass, as we would expect. I won't say anything, but I think you should. Okay. Gonna take her soda. Let's go ahead and break into her computer. No email. Anna Navarre. Agent Den, he's not like his brother, but seems eager to prove that he may, he may be better. I wonder if he understands what, what may be at stake here. Chew us out if he finds out you were here. Lock and load. Okay, let's find the load game. I don't know where the last quick save was. Oh, it was down here. Okay. That's fine. I think I just spent too long hacking it. But I might be able to change user if they if they share a computer, then I know how to log in. I didn't realize. Um we can try that, because I didn't realize they share, I don't know why they share a computer. Also, I've noticed that all, they, their, their computers are, and emails are rife with typos. I wonder if the augs are like, f***ing up their heads. Let's go ahead and quick save before we do this. Oh no, I think I have the login. It was uh, G. Herman and Shaderfreud. Shaderfreud, I think. No, Zeitgeist. Access denied, huh? We're gonna try that again. Z E I T G. E I S T, okay, and then Shaden F R E U D E. Blimey! All right, we're gonna hack it and hope we don't get caught this time. I'm gonna make sure I have those spelled right too.
Wait. G. Herman. Okay. Uh, mission objectives. A primary op operation recovering all the stowed ambrosia. If it falls into Terra's hands, it could be... Okay. Why did it say Zeitgeist? Let's try G. Herman. I think that's how you spell it. Access denied. Okay, I'm just gonna make sure. Zeit. Oh, Zeitgeist. Yep, that's how you spell it. And then Schadenfreude. Yep, that's how you spell that too. Let me just make sure I'm not. Okay, that doesn't work. I'm gonna make sure I have Gunther Herman's name. Herman, yeah. So, G Herman. Yeah, and then we're gonna try. G. Herman Schadenfreude. Nope, okay. There we go. No email today. save again and we're gonna go ahead and hack it again I don't know why they share a computer in change account okay uh, here's our best indicated galling attack while loss of ambrosia is regrettable uh, salvage with lead is a promising threat and there's no doubt the law blah 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 JM okay so Joseph Menderley, I'm gonna have to try and get her password at some point, but we know G Herman's is Zeitgeist and G Herman. Just gonna write that down. I don't know Navarre's password. Damn. That's locked. Talk to Agent him. Agent marvelous. In addition to an accuracy weapon modification, I've got some 7.62 millimeter rounds and a couple of multi-tools. Mr. Carter, I can't tell you how great it is to be a part of UNATCO. You should have seen the fighting in Castle Clinton. Yeah? I cleaned the place out. Went in shooting, huh? I guess that's what this agency is known for. I never thought I'd see this much action in one mission. In my day, international peacekeepers were citizens first and soldiers second. You can forget about that extra ammo. I'm only gonna give you the multi-tools. I think you should concentrate more on mission objectives and less on the enemy body count. Okay, so I'm confused here. I'm very confused. Uh, I didn't kill anybody, but the this guy seems to think I did. I don't know what his deal with, his deal with. I don't know what his uh, what his deal is. So accuracy increase for the trank dart would be nice, since I'm going to be using that more often. And thank you for the multi tools. I now have five. That's a good healthy amount of multi tools. Don't listen to what they're saying about the shootout in the park. And schedule. Love to know this door code. Agent. All right, let's go face the music. Whatever, whatever we got coming up. I was here first. Mr. Mandeley is in a meeting, JC. You'll have to wait. Okay. I was told to report for a debriefing. A debriefing. Do not worry. I will state in my report that I was satisfied with your performance. Be quiet. I am trying to listen. Just fire the arrogant son of a bitch. I wasn't exaggerating. He's our best agent. We don't need him. We've got his brother. And more on the way. He knows nothing. I think he does. You should never have sent him to Hong Kong. Let's be sensible. We have to look at the whole record. Mm. Look, I understand. He was your pet project, but it's out of my hands. Now that the shipment's been lost... 
I know, I know. I will comply with the order. That's all I ask. Carry on. I'm going downstairs to interrogate the prisoners. Okay, I'm actually gonna follow him. Forever. He will see you when he's ready. Hold on. Oh no, that's everything's still in real time when I do that, so let me see if I can talk to this ass. Carry on, Agent. Agent Denton, at your service. Denton. Yes, I hear you're turning out to be quite an asset to the coalition. Doing my best, sir. Forgive me, but I do not believe I know your name. We aren't ready for an introduction yet. No, it's not time. Just keep your nose to the pavement. You'll be well rewarded. Trust me. You aren't needed, Agent. Let's go ahead and hack this, see if there's anything I can glean from this computer. No email today. Okay, what a weird day. I don't know why there's no email anywhere. Let's go ahead and save the game again, and we're going to follow him and see what he says to the prisoners. We're looking to you to set an example. He's going to go ahead and preemptively get down there. Get on down there. Mosey on down, little dog. I don't think you're supposed to be down here, Agent. I can do what I want. Cause I've got guns. I won't such a pothead. You should go. You're such a pothead. Only senior staff members can interview the prisoners. Such a pothead. I wouldn't do that if I was you. Right, where's the, Where's this dude? Let's go, man. Manderly will chew us out if he finds out you were here. I guess your legs didn't get augmented properly because, god damn, dude. I have an important matter to attend to. Okay, I'm not in your way, don't worry. I don't think you're supposed to be down here, Agent. I'm gonna do what I want down here. I have one question. They already asked. I don't know. One must admire a man who can keep a secret because he has value. But you know more than others makes money and gives you a measure of power. You Walton Simons, you think I could be bribed? Margaret Forsyth under NSF protection in Queens. Your son Richard attending Bronx Science. You see, I have a few relevant facts myself. Care to make a trade? You wouldn't dare. I'll give you two seconds to decide. Get out of here, Denton. This is none of your business. Time's up. Where is the NSF taking the Ambrosia? They asked me already. I don't know. Need I remind you that in the case of a national emergency, FEMA has a list of six million Americans who will be transported to detention centers? Your tabloids call it RX-84. Yeah, including the President, Congress, and the Supreme Court. In my position, I find it very easy to add names to that list. Go to hell. The United States government has had emergency powers since World War II. We've never left the state of war. Speak for yourself. The federal government is just responding to a threat. A government should be about more than self-perpetuation. You will confess, by the way. I don't like to dirty my hands with that sort of thing, but you will confess. Certain intellectual properties, aside from the quantities of vaccine, concern me deeply. Has the NSF made any attempt at reverse engineering? Leave me alone. I don't know if we're going to glean too much if more. If you wanted to save people, you could have unloaded the whole shipment in Manhattan. Why the airlift? You said it yourself. Secrets are power. Well, I think that just had just about enough of that. Let's go break into Manderley's computer, uh, steal this soda, and uh, see if there's anything else that we need to do here at Unaco Base. I don't remember what the next mission is. I think it's the building down the street, another building in Hell's Kitchen you gotta break into. It's not my favorite. Actually, I hate most of the new. I don't hate. But um, I find most of the New York stuff I am a little mixed. boring. Okay, I'm trying to work. I am losing valuable time. 
Ooh. Let's see what else I can do. Hello, this. JC. Come in. Clerical task first. Your op bonus is split between the Castle Clinton and Warehouse objectives, 500 each. You get the full 1,000 plus 200 for how you handle the hostage situation in the Battery Park subway station. Good work across the board. Thank you, sir. Who is that you were meeting with? Politics, bureaucracy, mismanagement. JC, I've got some bad news. The mission failed. I would have taken out that Jojo punk, but he wasn't even in the warehouse. Never mind that. He slipped out before you even got to New York. What about the shipment? I'm just going to say it straight, JC. Your brother screwed up. We got nothing, and he's taking the heat this time. The Coalition is letting him go. What went wrong? We don't know. He hasn't reported back. The rest of the strike force says he lost his nerve. I think he was trying to avoid casualties. In Hell's Kitchen, instead of clips for the troops, he was issuing tear gas. Whatever the case, now it's your turn. We've got one more chance to retake that shipment. Has it been located? Take the chopper back to the city. We know they plan to put the Ambrosia on a plane, but we don't know which airfield. Where should I start? If I were the NSF, I'd be moving it through the subways, the abandoned parts of the infrastructure. I'll check out the subways. And stay away from the press this time, especially the tabloids. Do I need to quote the manual? Secrets are lives? Yes, sir. I have been waiting for 20 minutes. Sorry, Anna. What is it? A new assignment. I think Agent Denton should handle the assassination. Is there a problem? You lost your appetite? His enthusiasm in Battery Park was exceptional. The courtyard of Castle Clinton was a great Why do they keep attributing that to me? That's a glitch. It's kind of an exercise, you mean. I think he will make a good assassin. We should give him the opportunity. Hmm. Our pilot jock is waiting for you at the helipad. I am anxious to see one of the experimental agents perform. You aren't alone. Attack by, attack by stratagem. Sun Tzu said in The Practical Art of War, the best thing of if all is to take the enemy's country whole and intact. To shatter and destroy it is back. not so good. So too, it is better to recapture an army entire than to destroy it. To capture a regiment, a detachment, or a company entire than to destroy them. Hence, Don't to fight and to conquer in all your battles is not supreme rest. excellence. Supreme excellence consists in breaking the enemy's resistance without fighting. Alright, I'm going to save again. I'm going to try and break into his computer and do a bunch of other stuff in his office here. So you have your orders. J. Mander Lee. And it was night... Killer. Okay, from Avon of our report. As ordered, I have maintained a close watch on Agent Denton during our operation in New York. I have found his performance to be adequate to the task, if not without certain occasional reluctance. Uh, but it is my opinion that nano augmentations is in no way compensate for experience, and Agent Denton quite obviously has a considerable amount of learning to do before he can be considered a fully qualified agent. Agent Herman concurs with this evaluation. I will file a more detailed report when the time allows. WS uh, arrival. I'll be arriving at Liberty later today to survey the situation and assess the viability of the primary subject. Unless these are extenuating circumstances that you've so far failed, unless there are extenuating circumstances that you've so far failed to present to us, it is our belief that the primary may need to be terminated in favor of the secondary. Continue to profile the secondary's response to authority and mission objectives. If there is any deviation, isolate the subject for debriefing upon my arrival. Let me get back to work. What is this? Oh. What is this book? You will behave like a professional. That's an order. In carrying out their duties, you NACO agents. Uh, oh, okay, we already read that. I'm taking your American flag because you don't deserve it. I'm gonna go redecorate my office. Because every, everyone is screwing with me and my uh, decorating stuff. But my house plant is gone. I'm taking this face and that one. This one. This is right here. That's mine. Nice. Very nice little 
thing I got going up there. Whoa. What was that? Okay, a 10 mil. What's in here? Nothing, 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 nothing. I said carry on. <laughs> All right. So, okay. That, oh, wait. You know what? You have your orders, Mr. Member. Hold on. I'm taking this couch. Excuse me. Shouldn't have nano augmented me. I'm just gonna steal all your shit, guys. Nice. Look at this. This place is uh, it's coming together. Better turn this off. Here we go. All right. So what do I have left to do? Not much. Okay. Let's go ahead and save a game. Yeah, I'm not saying New York is bad. I just it's not my favorite part of the game. So I'm you know I'm kind of ready to get out of. Uh, Always check behind desks. That's Looking Glass Studios thing, but I mean, Iron Storm was packed with people from there, so it's not like it's not an Iron Storm thing either. As I discussed, I don't know if I discussed when I was talking about Thief Gold, my little debrief on the game, but um, the thing I like about Thief Three uh, and to some extent Deus Ex: Invisible War, so there seems to be a continuity. Uh, was full of it earlier tonight in the statue. There seems to be a continuity of the. Uh, the writing, the, the sensibilities, the level design, the, the lore, the plot. Who keeps turning these off? Oh, wait, I didn't never turn them off. Agent Navarro was gunning her motors about Castle Clinton. Yeah, she cleaned, yeah, she cleaned the place up. So, I don't know why everyone's attributing that to me. Um, I wanted to go do other stuff. I took care of the hostage situation first, and then she just went in guns bleeding. Why are they putting that on me? Fuck you guys. That's not fair. This one turns out a little better. Thanks, buddy. Okay, let's Your go to... Ready, the Gunther's full of it. Earlier tonight, in the statue... Get on the helicopter, Mr. Denton. Simons did not. Fuck you. Hey, buddy. Can I get a recharge? Thank you very much. Keep your lamp on. You know what? Uh, before we start this next part, I am going to make sure I did record all of that because if I didn't, once again, I will lose my fucking mind. So, 